Hello, hello. Just uh, give me one sec to figure out how do I get rid of this spam. <laughs> how the hell do you moderate on Twitch? I do not know. Uh, hello, Jess. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Just uh, kind of figuring out restream chat because there's spam from Twitch and I have no idea how to moderate on that thing. Ay, ay, ay. And I hope you guys are doing well. We'll be farming shortly. Uh, damn Twitch. Why is there no like mod controls like just on the chat? That would that would seem to make a lot of sense. Um. Hmm. Guess that's the downside to on-screen chat, huh? Gotta deal with the spam on the video. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll jump into Stardew shortly. I seriously have no idea how you'd moderate on the Twitch. Why would there not be like, is that from someone? Yeah, it's spam on Twitch. Um, I'm just very confused on how the hell you do things. Uh, like YouTube has like a little menu and I can just take action on an individual message. Apparently that does not exist on Twitch. Oh, so you can combine Twitch and YouTube chat. Yeah, yeah. The uh, the on screen chat is um, restream chat, so it uh, combines anything that you're streaming to, which is nice. Cause yeah, I have like a combined chat as well. So I have the YouTube one off to the side just in case. I just I have no idea how you're supposed to moderate in Twitch. Wasn't expecting to have to deal with this uh, immediately. Just want to jump into Stardew. Hope you guys are doing well. I feel like this is not something you should need to look up. Uh, uh, what are you up to tonight, Jess? Mm, more icons turned on. Oh, that's old. Lots of artists, they're trying to sell their art in Twitch. Oh, you know, this was just a uh, spam for, uh, you know, uh, view promotion stuff. I'm just baffled as to how to moderate on Twitch. I'm not seeing anything obvious. Hello, JJ. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, 
Hopefully they'll figure out this shortly. I mean, maybe it's a me issue, but I feel like you shouldn't have to look up in Google how to delete a message in your own chat on Twitch. Hmm. Uh, Jeff, do you use commands? That seems so excessive. Sleepy lurk from pile of blankets. Oh, I appreciate it. Do you just block? Sorry, I'll have this figured out in a second and we'll uh, jump in. Anyone familiar with Twitch by chance? Like, how is there not just, like, a little thing to just delete a message in chat? That seems like a very normal thing. Oh, that's good coffee. Uh, okay. I will not be long. We'll, uh, we'll jump in. How about right click? Yeah, I think some, you would think something like that, but, uh, not seeing anything. You would think that'd have to be something simple though, right? Uh, da, 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 da. Hello streamer. Hello, Flays. Flame. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Couldn't decide what to change my profile into, so I put it back as before. Just can't beat my old pick. Oh, yeah. Well, as long as you're happy with it, I guess. That works. Uh, okay, mod view, an entirely separate thing. Okay, Twitch is, Twitch is complicated. Right clicking the person's name. Yeah, there's nothing like that. There's a, apparently there's a whole separate mod area. What are you doing? Currently I'm trying to figure out how to delete people's messages on Twitch because apparently it's not straightforward. And then we are jumping straight into Stardew. Uh, how is this not simple? There's like stream manager view and then there's moderator view. Oh. Why you want to delete a message? Cause it's spam. And if it happens again, I don't want it on the on-screen chat. So I want to be able to know how to actually delete messages. 
which is apparently not simple in Twitch. Bafflingly. I literally cannot find anywhere to just delete a message. I need more coffee for this. Ah, oh, this is like, ah, oh, this is so... The way this is designed is so bad. <laughs> well, they're banned now. Seriously, though. How is there not just, like, simple, like, chat options? On YouTube, every single message has a little, like, dot, dot, dot thingy. You can just click and... It's got a channel activity, put user in timeout, hide user on this channel, remove message. I'm in Twitch, hello. <laughs> Well, at least I can figure out how to ban people now. I don't know how to delete individual messages, but I can ban people. That's something. I think. I mean, it'll do the job, I guess. Is it different in Twitch? Because in YouTube, I think it's pretty easy as I've been moderated before and I just click the message and UI appears with delete message. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's uh, super easy on YouTube and straightforward. I have no idea on Twitch. I found how to ban someone, which is apparently through the moderator menu, which is an entirely different UI and view than the stream manager that you would think would have actions in. But apparently not. And I can't see anywhere to just delete a message. Uh, I guess I'll figure out Twitch in the future and just go with bands for now. <laughs> I don't imagine too many will be needed, but... Okay, this is why I stay away from Twitch. Okay, I can collapse that, I can see chat. Okay, I like that I can make chat bigger and other things smaller in this menu, that's kind of nice. Okay, stodgy time, sorry about all that. I didn't expect a spam message immediately and for Twitch to be so difficult to use. I, yeah, it's baffling, I, I just... I mean, so there could be a me issue, maybe I'm missing something obvious, but... I feel like in general, when you look around everywhere and you resort to like Googling how to do something, there's probably a UI problem. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Emojis working Twitch. Oh, my headphones aren't plugged in. Good job. Good job. All right. Emojis working Twitch, yeah, for the, um, for some reason, yeah, if YouTube emojis are used with restream chat, I, I, yeah, just see the, um, the name thing, yeah. I hadn't looked for the on-screen one, I guess it's the same. But, yes, you can do whatever that is, yes. <laughs> okay. Stardew time. In one second. Okay. Situated, sip my drink, and we'll uh, we will do some stuff. But yeah, it is uh, 1080p today because of restreaming. So if you guys notice any quality issues, let me know at any point. Because it's Stardew, like, and it's you know no high movement and kind of simple, like it should be the same pretty much. Because um, I do want to start using restream more often. But um, not for certain games, because I don't want to compromise the YouTube quality. Because, uh, yeah, Twitch has just ridiculously low limits. 
they haven't changed their uh, bitrate limits in like 10 years. So uh, YouTube suffers because of it. But ideally, or hopefully I mean, uh, there won't really be any difference. Because of, um... Uh, yeah, because Stardew is like a simple looking game and all that kind of stuff, so it shouldn't uh, have an impact, unlike with a high motion 3D game type thing. All we two brain individuals should stay away from Twitch, too complicated. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, pretty much. Okay, hydrated. Stardew time. I don't know how to ban people on Twitch, so that'll cover me. Drink, you go somewhere. Alright. Uh, can't move my controller. Sorry, apparently I was not quite as ready as I thought I was. Professional streamer. It's fine. No worries. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we're all good. Uh, I also like chat on screen. I'm gonna have to adjust as we go because I just don't know. We sort. Oh shit! What is that? Kind of figuring things out. Ah, stardew. Okay, that does not quite work either. Ideally, like, uh, chat will be readable, but, um, need to kind of play around with the transparency a bit, I think. Well, bear with me a little bit, but I, I will avoid playing around, uh, too much here. We have a lot of star doing to do. Can't play back on like YouTube Live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you pay his dream? Engine is so bad. If I put it on 360p, it already has a stroke. Ah, that's rough. Top left. Ah, uh, yeah, that might not be a terrible idea. Maybe, maybe. Hmm. Oh, uh, I will consider that. I really, I prefer to keep it in the bottom left. Uh, let me just adjust super quick. Make it just a touch bit darker. And... Oh, right, I see. Refreshing it apparently clears the messages. I'm learning, I'm learning. Okay, again, well, bear with me while I smooth things out as quick as possible. Hmm. Not a terrible idea. How dare you consider it even as a decent idea? <laughs> no, it, uh, it might be good. Just, uh, I don't know, I feel like the bottom's like... It's easier to ignore for people who don't care about it, maybe. I think the, uh... Oh, Stardew. For some reason, like, Stardew's kind of a weird window on my computer. Like, sometimes I can pull windows over it, sometimes I can't. It's weird. Alright, let's make one final adjustment. And then we're good. Uh, 
Alright, done. Crash. Alright, we'll see how that goes for a bit and I'll stop playing around with things. I just have so many things open on my computer for this setup at the moment. Alright, didn't mean to delay so much getting into Stardew. Mana, are you a part of the Illuminati? <laughs> Not that I'm aware of. But yeah, sorry about this very slow start, yeah. Just with Twitch moderation and trying to figure out the chat a bit. I'm still mixed of the on-screen chat. I may just get rid of it if uh, necessary. I feel like it's better with the restream just because it can combine things and... But I, I don't know how readable that actually is. And I can't pull it on my main monitor apparently to look at it properly. I don't know, do you guys ever have that issue with Stardew? Like... The window for Stardew acts different than like anything else I play. In general. Like, I often can't pull things over top of the window for some reason. It's like a Stardew specific thing. Like, streaming or not. Oh man, I'm, I was almost like uh, defaulting to my old farm and the stuff down here. Right. All good. I know things. Get harvested. Yeah, we're, uh, we're almost into fall, so... We need to fix our setup a bit, I think. Uh, they will come up tomorrow, I think. Yeah, I still have a bit of muscle memory from my old farm, apparently. I won't call it Delane. It's like calling a mountain a roadblock. My point is, delay seems too small for this. Maybe hold is better, I don't know. Yeah, probably. Just gonna have a few bumps sometimes, I suppose. But ideally, you know, once things are sorted, they're sorted, so... Not something that needs to be uh, dealt with regularly. Just once. Um, alright, got the, uh, silo being built, that's good. Cows, ooh, cows are grown now, I think. I can't quite tell. Do you have milk? You do have milk, okay. Cows are grown. Alright, oh, because we got them, uh, we split them, alright. Okay, two of them are grown. Nope, that's good. Damn, some of these... The chickens are hard to see in the grass. Okay. All petted. Uh, we don't have cheese makers yet, do we? Uh. Might have to get on that. What do we need for those? Hardwood, copper, stone, wood. Ooh, okay. I forgot they needed a uh, hardwood. That cow is still a minor mana. <laughs> it would seem so. Um, how much hardwood do we have? I'm assuming not much. Um, uh, did we use it? Oh no, we have one. Ah. That's helpful. Well, we better get cheese makers going, shouldn't we? It's just going to be helpful food for now too, even though I'm probably going to want to sell it. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to like, get back into what we're actually doing. Because we uh, got the barn and coops, so that's good. The silo is underway. We probably want to get them upgraded. Be good to get the first house upgrade. 
What else do we need to spend on? Right, do we get that inventory upgrade? Um, the first house upgrade's only 5k, right? So that's probably worth it. Yeah. Um, but I guess we'll go to the... Oh, wait. We can't go to the woods without the chair, can we? Right. <laughs> ah. Forgot about that. Hello, kitty. You've traveled a long way today. Right, so yeah, I was gonna go get our hardwood, but yeah, we can't actually go there without, um... Without the chair. Just fine. Uh, do we have a festival tomorrow? Not sure. Better check that. Oh god damn it, my coffee is already warm. That's pain right there. How much is this again? It is 10,000 for the next one, okay. Okay. This is cheating? Oh, the chair, right. <laughs> it's, it's possible. Maybe, maybe, maybe a smidge. Maybe just a little bit. Mm, okay. What materials do we need for a house upgrade? Because we should have enough kind of backlog with, we've got kegs and things going now, so we should have a little bit of money coming in, so... Getting the first house upgrade's probably worth it now. Gonna be totally serious, when I saw people eat cheese in the mines, I thought they were a new kind of superfood. The idea of it being cheese just didn't come to me. Or you just sell them? Oh yeah. Yeah, I mean, my... I'm inclined to like sell them, but um... Damn, she's going fast. The NPCs normally go that fast? Can't miss tomorrow's festival. It's one of the most beautiful wonders of the valley. Oh, well, I guess that answered my question. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm inclined towards, uh, yeah, I'm um, selling, but they do seem to be decent food, like early game, if you don't have anything else kind of uh, set up. Oh, God damn it! Most days. Why can't they just like, you know, give their actual days? That'd, that'd be much not easier for me. And just, you know, it's a normal thing to do. Something was probably blocking them. Oh, okay. She's acting suspicious. Hello, Crystal. Hope you're doing well. Excuse me. Everyone seems a little happier on the weekends, don't you think? I don't know, man. I ain't happy. It's Saturday and people aren't at their businesses that say most days. Oh my god, get out of my way. What is tomorrow? Oh, the moonlight jellies. Gotcha. What is she planning? I'm not sure. Okay, 4 p.m. It has not been a productive day. And I really want to go reheat my coffee, because that is... That is disappointing. Ugh, I got all, like, thrown off by the, uh, start of the stream. Damn Twitch. And also, chat. Um, if you guys do, like, look at the on-screen chat, just, uh, let me know how readable it is, because it's partially transparent, because I don't, I feel like that's kind of the best compromise for taking up less space. And I forgot the chair again. Um, but I don't know how readable it is on, under different, like, yeah, it's probably going to vary a bit. 
Are we just gonna have to start carrying a chair on us? That's questionable. But maybe. Maybe. Yeah, we want to get cheesemakers going, so we go chop some hardwood. You can read it well? Okay. It's good to know. But yeah, it, it, we just kind of like, it's still experimental as to whether uh, we'll keep it or not, or how things will go. I, just, I can see it being convenient just with Restream for um, uh, the fact that you can see both chats type thing. Quick question, what time is it for you in real life? Because it's midnight for me. Uh, it's about the same for me. It is 12.26am. Uh, so uh, about the same. That is report on my perfection run. I'm going insane trying to get the extra one million I need. Ah. Well, I wish you continued luck. How many are here? What can we get, like 12 a day here or something? I guess, I mean, we don't need that much. We grab the mushrooms while I'm here too, huh? Slime in a minute. Wait. Just trying to chop some wood, man. Ah, uh, I'm stuck. Damn secret woods. Too complicated. But uh, yeah, I guess if it's midnight for you, I assume we're in uh, almost the same time zone. All the same. Yeah, I guess you can get 12 a day. All right, that's, yeah, that's something. We only need 10 for a cheese press anyway. Probably need to smelt some stuff. wasn't planning to make the one million in fall and winter am I totally unprepared but confident as I thought I could do it and it's starting to look bleak only two more weeks of winter before year five. Oh, okay damn year five it's a, it's a long way away for me <laughs> but we'll get there oh, I'm gonna even make some more coal Um, how many cheese presses do we want? I feel like probably four. Be good. Yeah, we might go with four. Just for convenience. Uh, I'm gonna need some more wooden stone, huh? Uh, what are, what resources do I need to upgrade my house? I do not remember. Um, I should probably check that. Unless someone knows. I only remember that it costs 5k. I think? Or is it 10k? Er, Maybe it's more. Crap. Don't wouldn't a lot of money. That sounds about right. 
10k and 450 wood. Oh, okay. Ah. Why was I thinking it was 5k? Hmm. Okay, that's unfortunate. At least it only costs woods. That's fine. Huh. I, I, I don't know why it was in my head that it was only... 5k now. Huh. That is unfortunate. But, that's one cheese press. That's something. Hmm. Okay, I'm not sure about getting the house upgrade now. Let's see on that. Gonna lose again. Uh, what are we gonna put in there? Peppers? Sure. It'll do. Oh, I gotta remember to check the, uh, the cave. On this map, I just forget about it. <laughs> for our farm. We could really do with a few more sprinklers for next month. Oh god, I can't wait to get to Iridium Sprinklers. Right, Iron Gold Refined Quartz. What have we got in the way? Uh, okay, we could actually make a few then. We could do another five without it being a problem. Okay. That would be good. Just need more wood. Yeah, okay. We can do that. Oof, it's already 12. This was not a productive day. Oh, what can I use some energy on? Is Four Corners still best farm after the update? Oh, I have no idea on that. I just, uh, I just liked the idea of the Four Corners one. I've only played Forest Farm before this, so I just, uh, I like the, uh, I like the idea of being able to like, split everything up and organize things. But uh, I have no idea what's considered best. Hello, JAP. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I didn't know this was uh, considered best at all. But uh, I'm liking it so far. Okay, better get to bed. We'll get one more cheese press tomorrow and it'll probably be fine for now. We'll just do two and two. As for the house upgrade, um, not sure now. I kind of want the backpack upgrade. Tonight at around 10 o'clock p.m., a rare and beautiful event will take place. The moonlight jellies will be passing by Pelican Town on their long journey south for the winter. We're all gathering at the beach to watch. You don't want to miss this. See you tonight. Indeed. And what do we got to harvest for our final day? Okay, they came through. Nice, nice. 
Yeah, I thought that were going to be a day off. Ah. Oh, I got some more squash. Oh, crap, right. Why did I go at three? That doesn't make a lot of sense. We'll get the bag upgrade and we'll get the house upgrade next. Yeah, that might be the way to go. Che yeah, I, th I think we'll keep cheese for now, as painful as that is for me, because I really want to sell it. It's 56, 52.6k people that are streaming Dragon's Dogma. Damn. Are you like watching the streams or streaming? Because that would be a lot of people. And what is this? Oh, grape jelly. Delicious. Uh, that's... You know what? We'll just... We'll use that for... Um, what do you call it? Uh, the community bundle. Yeah, I think we'll use that for that maybe. Oh shit, we complete that. We can complete that with a cheese. Ooh, all right. It's good to get that completed. Let's do that. Uh, I'm gonna need. Why am I grabbing at singles? I just did that before. <laughs> Need a few more of those. I'll worry about them in a bit. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, we'll try. We'll get five more sprinklers. We should be able to get them before tomorrow. That should give us a decent enough setup for now. Uh, yeah, we'll make a quick trip to the community center. We need to go to the secret woods. We can get a second cheese press. Oh, the grass. I'm glad they have food so I don't have to pay for stuff, but damn. Uh, where are you, chickens? Did you get pets? No, you did not. Thank you. Looks like they're all milkable now. Can anyway, we see you now? I'm gonna leave before I get spoiled too much. I have updates, still hasn't released on my version, see ya. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. I oh, hope you don't have to wait too long. Uh, yeah, appreciate you stopping in, please. Hope you have a good rest of your day. Oh, damn festival day. Come on, Robin. The festival isn't at 10 p.m. and you're not even working on my farm. That's rough, man. That's rough. Uh, that's convenient. We're making a trip and... Yeah, that works. Couple more for the community center. Good, 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 good. Uh, wait, so we need, um... Three more. Yeah. That's good for now. All right, let's go grab a little bit of hardwood. And I am going to go reheat my coffee shortly because I'm going to keep looking at it and it's keep going to bothering me. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. But um, yeah, if anyone like has feedback regarding the on-screen chat at any point, just uh, just let me know, because uh, I don't know how I feel about it yet. So in general, uh, readability, any of that kind of stuff, uh, yeah. 
Feedback always appreciated. I'm a chair. Back on YouTube. Twitch is just not for me. Oh, welcome back. Sort of. Yeah, I guess, uh, I don't know, because I don't even know if it's working well on Twitch, because I, I have an unstable thing popped up there. Average stream bitrate too high, even though it's 6k, which to me is very low. But that's what it should be, apparently. I don't know, did you actually have any issues, uh, by the way, Jess? Like, was the, uh, playback smooth? I don't know why it says unstable. I don't know. It's experimental. I really like the idea of restream and like being able to stream on multiple platforms at the same time. I uh, I do not like the idea that I have to compromise YouTube quality for the sake of Twitch, though. <laughs> that part is very unfortunate. Hopefully at some point, uh, Twitch will allow higher quality streaming. I guess we can just leave the chair there, huh? That's probably fine. There's no issue with smooth. Oh, okay, it's good to know. Hello? Um, coffee bean? Wait, do I need to buy a coffee bean here? Or... Wait, how else can I get coffee beans? I don't even remember from the last farm. Or do I need to start it from here? Oh, gonna need to remember to plant the rare seed, huh? Which is super awkward, because it takes like... All of fall... And if lightning hits it, oh, that'd be so rough. That would be so rough. I'm going to buy one more. Screw it. I, I don't trust lightning. I guess I'm going to buy this coffee bean too, because I don't know if I need to or not. I don't remember how I got them last time. I just remember I had a lot at one point. Yeah, we'll get one more cheese press. That'll be good. Try and sort out stuff here before we, uh... Go to the thingy tonight. What season are you in? Coffee only grows in spring and summer? Yeah, I'm right at the end of, uh, summer. I just, uh, I was just grabbing that in case, because I don't actually remember how I got coffee beans originally. I didn't know if I need that to actually start producing coffee in general, or if I'm just forgetting how to, how to get that. Either way, if I need it, it's going to be there for next spring. Also, hello, Reality. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Two rare seeds now. If lightning hits them both, I will be un very unhappy. <laughs> That'll be very unfortunate. Uh, right. Make a trip to the community center. And... What else? Uh, right, one more cheese press. Uh, what else is it? Oh, stone. Yeah, I couldn't remember if coffee beans came up in the regular, like, shop, like Pierre's, but I didn't think I recalled seeing it there, so... I was just grabbing that in case. Um, 
what else? What else? Right, sprinkler stuff. Got five of those. Got five of those. Two more of those. Get those going. Uh, wait, what? Did that only take one quartz? Um, did something get changed? Did I just, what, what, what? Okay, I'm going to the community center. Did I just like misread numbers or did something, what? I'm pretty sure I had 25, right? Why did that only take one each? Did they change how uh, refined quartz works? I have no idea. Artisan? Have some jelly. Oh, interesting. It goes red there. And some chiz. Ooh, keg. That is always welcome. That's two of those down. Uh, that was all right. Yeah. All right, process that. Put those away. Put that down. Yeah, I think we'll just try and get the uh, try and get the five more sprinklers sorted. And yeah, I guess the uh, festival will be coming up soon. Uh, sorry, I'm a little like underslept again. <laughs> I only slept for about four hours this afternoon. So my brain is a little slow. One day I'll sleep consistently. One day. Maybe. Yeah, what? It's only taken one quartz. It used to take five, right? Like, I'm not imagining things. I'm pretty damn sure even last time it was taken five, right? Did they change that, or...? I'm pretty sure it used to take five. Did it not? I feel like I need to look that up. That confuses me. It's five for coppers and irons, right? Yeah, yeah. Or I could have swore it was five quarts. I remember one and one colon, five for everything else. Oh, okay, I could just be mistaken, obviously. I mean, you guys would know better. But I could have swore I'd have it taken five previously, because I... I feel like I worked... Um, I'm so confused by that. Uh, it is very confusing. Because I could have swore I'd like worked it based on that previously and I recall, yeah, I don't know, I'm, I'm very confused, but it is what it is and that's very convenient. You need more coffee? I do, but that's unrelated. That's, that's a really confusing to me that that's the case. 
Melon wine. Ooh, that sounds pretty good. Keg down for a break sound back. I definitely need more coffee, but that's that's baffling me. I'm gonna have to check the last video. I mean it must be that, but I'm just I'm so confused now. Because I could have swore I'd like used up quartz supplies and seen the number go down by five and But obviously yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm baffled. Either way, that means we have, we have enough quartz for way more sprinklers. Oh crap, I need a gold. Said, I said my brain was not working. Well, that's unfortunate. I was thinking uh, copper, iron, and quartz for some reason. Damn. Well. We need those regardless, but I am so confused about the quartz. That is a, that is a separate issue from my brain. <laughs> yeah, we'll, uh, we'll keep the cheese for now, just while it's the normal one, I think. Just because that'll actually cover us for energy pretty well. Um, yeah, I mean, we've got a decent kind of area that's uh, covered by sprinklers. And we'll just make, like, another patch that's not this whole mess that happened. Something like that. Um, yeah, I guess we've got to go to the festival shortly. I'm just, um... I think I want to do money-wise. Backpack upgrade or house upgrade? Hmm, tough one. I feel like I'll probably use the backpack upgrade more. I'm gonna grab our mushrooms. Oh my god, I just realized you got the living hat. Wow, congratulations, man. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I mean, when I got it, I didn't know it was rare or anything. I'd, I'd never heard of it before. Uh, but yeah, I, I found out how rare it was after that. And it's, uh, it's a pretty sweet hat. But yeah, I was just uh, clearing some stuff over here, not even thinking. I had no idea. And suddenly I got a hat and I was like, oh nice, I got a hat. And turned out it was pretty damn rare. Uh, I guess we're good then. Yeah, I'll figure out what we want to do. We'll go enjoy the festival. Yeah, I might get the inventory upgrade. It's going to be convenient, and we should be at a... We'll get another 10k pretty quick for a house upgrade, I'm sure. Uh. Okay. Abigail just went into Pierre's at 10.30. Okay. That's, uh... She is very suspicious today. Hmm. If she's going to Pierre's at 10.30, hey Jess, maybe you don't need to worry about her anymore. <laughs> she's planning something I knew. Yeah, well, the suspiciousness of her has not changed. The foam pudding. Modern rug. Hmm, next year I will buy everything for now. All good. These candles are romantic, aren't they? Hello, drinky. Don't tell Gus, but I'm a little disappointed there's no buffet tonight. Moonlight jellies. I wonder how they taste. Uh, I would never try it, of course. Sure you wouldn't, bud. Sure. 
Okay, we're not on the clock now, so... I will, uh... I'll be back in one moment. Well, one minute anyway. Just gonna heat my coffee real quick. And I'm back. Thank you for waiting. Right. What is everyone doing? I want to see the rare green jelly. Do you now? Life is so easy for a jellyfish. Just letting the waves carry you onward forever. I mean, I don't think they live that long, but... Well, there is that. That's a heavy load of people for an ancient wooden dock. I'll stay over here near the beach. I need to take a picture of the jellies when they arrive. I can't believe summer's over. I feel like it just started. Yeah. That's life, man. You see, Sebastian? <laughs> Chibi Manu is twitching. You hear a little bit. This does happen. I thought I saw something moving in there. Something big. Something dark. Just trying to scare you. I wonder if they're poisonous. Maybe I shouldn't push Sebastian in the water after all. Such a rare and exciting thing. Oh, hello, Abigail. I saw you going into Pierre's at 10.30 at night. The jellies were here a year ago, and they'll be back again a year from now. Nature is amazing. I hope they are, I hope they are babies this year. Good evening, Mana. The moonlight jellies are close. I already saw one glowing in the distance. Once we launch the candle boat, they'll come up to the docks and say hello. Most nightfish will be scared of the light. These are strange ones. There, I just saw something glowing. Oh, it's gone. Look out there at the endless sea. Deep underwater, all kinds of life are moving around the dark. Here he is, isn't it? I wore my special shoes tonight. No one noticed. Ah, uh, poor Clint. I notice he's standing like next to Ele uh, Emily. <laughs> If we keep polluting the oceans, the jellies will surely go extinct. It's already in the process of happening. What a shame. We have no respect for nature anymore. Nature is pretty tasty. Oh, a tent man, my boy. What are you doing over here? I'll just sneak up when the jellies arrive. I don't want to bother anyone. You're never a bother, man. Never. I remember seeing the jellies once as a little girl. Oh, how I jumped with joy when they arrived. But that was long ago. I'm a lot less energetic now. What? Why are you looking at me like that? You think I'm too old to enjoy something like this? Good morning, so Hey, good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Well, summer's over. To be honest, I'll be happy to say goodbye to these blaster mosquitoes. It's kind of cold, actually. I guess fall is right around the corner. Ooh, it's past my bedtime. The moonlight jelly. What a remarkable species. 
We're very lucky that they stop here on their long journey south. It's unknown why they're attracted to light. Very curious. Indeed. Indeed. Reborn as a vending machine. I now wander the dungeon. That's enough isekai for today. <laughs> Hello, SPC. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Hey, I'm paying my respects to another bygone summer. Wait, why is she there? Abigail lives at Pierre's. I bet she does. Is that a real yawn? No. <laughs> Just reading. How did you find me back here? I thought I was well hidden. Perhaps you are blessed with the gift of clairvoyance. I'm here to observe the Lunaloos, or moonlight jellies as you call them. They possess an unusually potent magical aura for an aquatic life form. Okay. I feel like he knows stuff, but then other times it's like, uh, okay, buddy. Okay. I think we chatted to everyone. And I ain't rich enough for shopping. So I think we're good. What do you think? Should I launch the boat now? Go for it. You launch, I have my coffee before it's cold again. Very good yawn imitation, thank you. <laughs> Hello jellies. Oh, there's babies. And one suspicious one. What are you? Coming right at me. What are you suspicious jellyfish that is possibly not a jellyfish? And why are you coming at me? Hmm, suspicious. The glow of summer has faded. Now the moonlight jellies carry on toward the great unknown. Yeah. A little bit. Cheese, though. Hmm, delicious. Cheese and wine. Perfect, perfect. Very good. Gotta get the more melon wine going. And we can sleep. In the bin you go. Don't come out little jellies, Gus will boil you. He did seem a bit curious about their flavor. I can't imagine they taste great. Just a, just a hunch. <laughs> oh, okay. Purple. Oi, oi, oi. Man, it's always such like a... It's such a change. Damn it, why did I have a corn there? Okay. We'll make it work. Damn it, I put corn there too. Alright. Get rid of these. Still got plenty of money for seeds. That's something. 
Tend the animals real quick. Oh, silo's done. Good, good. TV? Oh, yesterday TV would have been... That would have been a thing, huh? Maybe Wednesday. That'd be nice. Maybe. Chickens? Where are the others hiding? Okay, these, they really do blend in now. Where are you at, Chicken the Fourth? There you are. Good. Oh, I've still got plenty of grass, fortunately. Right. Better get these sorted then. And we need some gold so we can, uh, get more sprinklers. Oh my god. I'll never get the directions right in this game. about today obviously getting uh farm stuff sorted and then yeah tomorrow we might try and get some gold so we can fill in a few more sprinklers damn it oh yeah yeah directions are difficult i still really wish you could activate the sprinklers be very convenient. Alright, that's good. So we'll make a couple more this side. What are we at? 10 a.m. Not sure how much I want to plant. Do like a long section over here too. Something like that. Should really make sure to get rid of those, huh? Oh my god. I really don't understand the directions. Like that. Why does that do up? I find it very confusing. Like, because if I press down, it'll change to down, but then other directions don't change. I don't, I don't get how it uh, actually works, even after playing for, I don't know, a decent number of hours now, I guess. But I, I it just doesn't click with me how it's actually meant to work. <laughs> Oop. Train. Okay. I mean, stone is something. Oh, coal's good. I'll take coal. Yeah. Keep throwing me coal. Unfurls from my nest. Great, but it's something. Gotta figure out directions. Yeah, like what makes you turn? It's so confusing to me. Like I'm clicking up here and I don't turn up. But then just then I turned up. 
Is it because you need to click closer? I don't... Now I'm not turning at all. But then I did just turn. Oh, I, I just, I don't know. It just doesn't click with me. And yeah, train did not give uh, anything much, but uh, still worth trying. Cause it doesn't cause like actual like huge issues or anything. I just, it, it's confusing to me. If you hoe a square, you didn't mean to. You can revert it to normal with a pickaxe. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I probably should do that for uh, yeah, that would, yeah. Keep things a bit cleaner. Free rocks, Helly Kelly. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. I think there's a menu option that highlights the box your tool hit, but I'm not sure off the top of my head. Uh, yeah, I think I did turn that on once before. I don't know if that, yeah, would show that though, or... Because I don't know, the, the turning just seems inconsistent to me, but it, I'm not sure. So yeah, it, it doesn't cause like major issues, I've just... Even after this amount of hours, I, it, it hasn't kind of clicked to me as to how it's supposed to work. Uh, what are we planting? Hmm. Don't know. I like pumpkins. Pumpkins are probably good. Eggplants seem like good value. Uh, amaranths. Any fall suggestions? I don't really know what's good. Cranberries? God, they're expensive. Hmm, I might need more inventory space. Um, grapes, eh? Red blub. <laughs> I assume that means cranberry. Also remember the community center? Yeah, yeah. I don't really know what I need from there. Yeah, pumpkin, eggplant, yam. That's really all I think. I guess we'll get some yamsies. Uh, yeah, I get some eggplant. Do I need amaranth for anything? Right. Get some cranberry. God, they're expensive. Ah, it's not gonna be back. Two fifty. Um. Like, do I need amaranth for something? I feel like, uh, maybe. Maybe not. Uh, maybe I don't. I do want more pumpkins. It's still not many. Um, yeah, we'll get more of them. Okay, I guess the house upgrade or uh, inventory upgrades gonna have to wait a moment. <laughs> I 
Throw some cheese. I feel like we're not going to have that many crops planted, but... Create some bok choy. I don't know how worth it is, though. I think it's a bundle item. Maybe, Amaranth. Yeah, I thought I did need it for something, but I, I don't know. Um... Ah, oh, the magnets are... They're a real double-edged sword, man. It's like, somewhat convenient, but then it stops you from being able to drop things. Oh yeah, yeah, Man, those, uh... The mossy trees in fall do not look very healthy. Let's see what else we, uh, we can get back there. See what else we can grab. Yeah, I thought I needed Amaranth for something at some point, but I, I don't know. Maybe it's a quest. Does someone ask for Amaranth at some point? Maybe. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just plant. I'll plant a few. And. I don't know, like, bok choy, like, it's quick, but I, I don't know if it's actually at all worth it. It's cheap. We'll get a few of those to fill out a little bit. Two more of them. Two more of them. Add a loop. Maybe money? Uh, I'm not sure, yeah. I just, uh, I feel like I did remember, like, needing it at some point. Money asks for Emirates. Oh, okay, she does then? Okay. Yeah, they, you, these are mossy trees. They they look like... They do not look great in fall. Like, they look really, like, sickly or something. Hmm. Oh, right. Rare seed. Gotta get them planted, too. Yeah. And just really hope lightning doesn't get it. I mean, I'm planting two of them. So, we'll hope for the best. Oh crap, I need a... Uh, I need fertilizer as well. God, it's already 5pm. Gonna have to rush. Some of these aren't watered. Oh, directions. Okay, sometimes that does cause problems. Just not major ones. I don't know if they need to be, uh, fertilized, but anyway. I have to rush. I really want another coffee. Hopefully I'm not missing any... 
think that's good. The cranberries. That's a thing, apparently. Don't know who would ever want that. I don't know what it is. I don't like it. I need more of that. I think a cow's like it. Oh, okay. I see, I see. I don't know what it is, but I don't trust it. Alright, where else? Water. Go away, bird. I don't trust you either. I don't even know if I really need to fertilize everything I'm fertilizing, but nonetheless. Seems like a thing to do. I assume you get more farming XP for uh, higher tier stuff. I, I don't actually know. We're at 9.30. Okay, on time. Yeah, we might try and get some gold over the next couple of days so we can get a few more sprinklers set up. There, uh, what have we got left? Just 16 of those. Um. Yeah, I guess we'll do like another thing here. Oh, I don't even know how I did that. The other eight can be fill-ins, I think. Oh, just one more here. <laughs> I'll be fine. Doesn't feel like we've planted a lot, but it'll do for now, I guess. Not that I could have afforded any more anyway, so. Yeah, and we'll get uh, those filled in with sprinklers. That'll be good. Uh, yeah, we tended to the animals, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. That'll do. That'll do. Now stretch. <laughs> Ugh. I'll take my jumper off, it's a bit warm. Oh, much better. Not like an overly warm night, but warm enough to not need a jumper. 
Current funds, 10G. Not great. But probably lucky I didn't actually get the uh, upgrade, otherwise we wouldn't have had a ton of cash for uh, seeds. Yeah, we have, uh, we have enough stuff for at least five more. Well, actually, I guess we can get a fair few sprinklers. We just need, uh, we just need gold. Maybe we'll try and get, like, six more for now. I don't have too much watering to do. Uh, yeah, we might just tend the animals and go to the mine. Focus on getting a bit of gold. And I guess we still need to complete the mine, don't we? We got to 100, but we didn't actually get it at the bottom. Because I was thinking the 100 was at the bottom, but... It is not. clear out some of this. Leave some of it, just uh, enough that we'll, we'll have another patch here when we have a sprinkler for it. Uh, any of you guys are uh, playing Stardew at the moment? Alright, anything else interesting? Or not interesting? <laughs> Either way. Damn chickens. You make good stuff, but... You really blend into the grass, especially them ones. <laughs> In the fall grass, anyway. Thank you. Yeah, we might just keep the uh, mayo machine and, and that here for now. It's kind of, like, convenient because it's... I see it more, so, like, I'm more likely to actually, like, get things processed. Because before when, like, last farm, when I put them like, inside there, I'd, like, set them up, like, when we are in there, but then I wouldn't really think of them again. So, like, this way, you can kind of get both uh, lots processed in a day with just two. That kind of works out nicely. Playing satisfactory at the moment. Oh, yeah, nice, nice. Yeah, I like satisfactory. I haven't, uh, I haven't played much of it, but... I like it. Also, hello LK. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, Satisfactory is one I've wanted to go get back to and play properly. Oh, they're done. Um, what are we putting in there now? Some blueberries, is that worth it? Maybe. Need to get some more kegs rolling in. Oh, that one's not even filled. Whoops. Yeah, Satisfactory and uh, Factorial ones I want to get back to. Finding your clothes. Also good in its own way. Uh, yeah, let's go to the mine.
You're bad at it? Ah. <laughs> Ah, hello there, Mana. You showed up at the perfect time. It's our new special orders board. Robert and I built it from scratch. Um, Lois, all you do is hold the nails. Ahem, <laughs> ignore her. Now, let me explain. You see, with Mana Land Farm back in business, the local economy has really been picking up. As a result, some of our local townsfolk have been asking me for a way to source local ingredients for their businesses or personal projects. So Robert and I came up with the idea of a new special orders board, where people can post bigger jobs than would make sense for the old billboard outside Pierre's. Yeah, for example, I plan on requesting some hardwood for a bed I want to make. I won't put you on the spot, but if you want to help me out, you can just accept the job from this board. Who knows, maybe if the bed turns out well, I'll start selling them in my shop. Sure. I thought so. I wouldn't expect anything less from you, Mana. So, can we say that you're on board? Well, I'm sure you're busy, so we won't keep you away from your work any longer. As always, I appreciate your willingness to contribute. Take care, Mana. Should probably go check that out. Wait, why wouldn't they do that on a Monday when it resets? Hmm. What do we got? Two dozen eggs? Not right now, buddy. I think I'll be good for now. Should we play Mana Bingo? I have eight old cards from before. I can share your card on Discord. I don't know how many people are about at the moment. YouTube numbers are never very helpful with that. Playing the Princess Peach game at the moment. I'm cross-stitching. How, uh, how is the Princess Peach game going? Oh yeah, I was going to mine, wasn't I? All oh, right, yeah, because it jumped. Okay. So many things on my other monitors. Moving things. Uh, all good. Uh, got a lot of crap on us, don't we? Well, we mainly just want gold at the minute. All right. I guess I don't want to go to right five. No ore. I remember this. Nice. Oi! What the? You little shit! Oh yeah, yeah. Fun if we have at least four players in live chat. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, yeah. I don't know how many people are about at the moment or not doing things. Uh, it's been a while, so it's always interesting. Bingo. Cleaned up my space a bit, not sure what to play afterwards. Have you been uh, playing any roguelikes uh, lately? Guess we might as well get these as well, because we do need our uh, stone.
I like it. All the different abilities are cool. There's a lot of variety. Okay, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you on that side of the rocks, buddy. I don't know what that did, but... Not cool. The streets of Rogue as of recent. Okay. I should check out the uh, first game sometime. Gold? Bingo thumbs up. Okay, helmet guy, that's fine. As long as you're not that wizard guy. Well, we've got two more sprinklers. Ah, oh, directions. And exhausted. <laughs> Have some cheers. Delicious. Any other gold? Nope. Oh. Alright, we're getting a bit here and there. Oof, one ore. Two ore, please. Maybe it's on Game Pass? Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, it might be. I'll have to check that. I should really make another coffee soon. I'll just probably forget about it. E either way. I don't need too much gold. Well, I want lots of gold, but don't need too much. Oh my god. Energy goes fast. Delicious. Maybe. Still not sure if the build snacks are actually delicious or not. Ah, I really did not come here with enough space. Uh, I'll eat the algae, I guess. Can't even pick up that. Really need to get the inventory upgrade. <laughs> or also just not come here with so much crap in my inventory. Both good. No, oh, well, that's three, uh, that's three sprinklers. Ah, uh, fried calamari. I don't even remember where I got that. Well, it's fine. Oh, you, you go away. I think of the field snacks like granola bars. 
I guess that checks out. Oi, oi, oi. Ah, uh, do I need to drop something else? I hate leaving stuff. Slime versus Void Essence, eh. Probably need the slime more. Yeah, we got to 21 gold, maybe that'll do us for right now. That's four more sprinklers. Delicious, delicious, granola bars made of pine cones. A little bit. A little bit. Any immediate gold? Oh, there is. Alright, we'll get these few and then that'll do us. Or, well, any on this floor and that'll do us. We got those pine cones in it. Granola bar with pine cone. Mm-mm. Crunchy. Well, no, that's five. All right, that'll do us. Try to come back here with inventory space. I don't like leaving so many things on the ground. Those going. Uh, they go there. Guess we can start selling a bit of cheese soon. We don't need too much for energy, I don't think. Blueberries will do for now. Hopefully start just moving over to the kegs. Uh, what are kegs again? I always forget. Oh, it's copper and iron. Gotcha. Oh, it's that stretch. Um, a little bit more. Uh, I'll just worry about those for now. I guess they'll take a minute though, won't they? It is gold. Yeah, we may as well just sleep. That'll be fine. This tomorrow onwards will be pretty much covered. Indeed, Rooster. Indeed. There, coal. More chairs. Drink mayonnaise option. A barbaric. That's some psychopath shit right there. One, two, three. Wait, did I not plant something on that corner?
Uh, okay. Don't know how I managed to miss that. I might need to move some of these around too, huh? Can't really think about that. That's probably fine. Let's do them all in the center across. Hopefully not kill any plants because of the directions. Um, I assume they're covered like that. Seems fine. You don't drink mayo? I do not. That is beyond my capabilities. Made a comment on Reddit about how I like Japanese mayo, but don't drink it from the bottle. I got 150 likes. Oh, wait, what does drinking mayo even do? I didn't even look like, is there an energy thing on it now or? I didn't check that. I guess that'll cover us completely for now, yeah. Like two more. That'll be good. Where you at, chickens? Is that everyone? Other than kitty? Ah. What? Why do you have no milk? Oh. Fine. Our milk. Got our eggs. It's fall. That it is. We in the orange season. And brown season and some green apparently. The seasons of chickens hiding in grass and being hard to find. Very good. Right, welcome back, place. Sprinklers. Boom and boom. All covered. It's not a crazy amount of crops, but they're all covered. Drink it in front of an NPC. Oh, does that do something? I didn't know drinking mayo was a thing. I, I, I don't think it is a thing. Unless you're a psychopath. I'd like to give my cows a special treat. They're such good girls and hungry too. Could you bring me a one bunch of amaranth? They love the stuff. Thanks dear. Oh, well, there we go. And we will never grow amaranth again after that. <laughs> Alright, 
they can go away. They can go away. Um. Hmm. What do we need to be doing at the moment? I uh, wouldn't mind just getting bottom of the mine done. Yeah, we'll do that. Would you rather drink mayo or eat pine cones? Oh, I'm pine cones all the way. Hmm. Yeah, I guess let's worry about the mine first. That's fine. That's fine. And then probably need to chop some trees. We really need a good supply of wood. Also, if the bus service is like not operating, why is the bus just sit there with the door open? <laughs> that doesn't seem like a great idea. I don't know how far down I have to go. What the hell is that? I do not recall seeing one of those before. Oh, I dropped squid ink, okay. I'm Linus, I do either. That's one more sprinkler. I don't know how far down I gotta go, I really don't remember now. In my head it was a hundred, but apparently not. I'm assuming 110 or 120. Either way, more gold. Linus is flexible. guys. Oh, oh, damn it. Saw the gold there as I clicked. Okay, I'm getting, I feel like I'm getting lucky on ladders today. And another one. Get my gold, then I'm going down. I don't actually need any more sprinkles at the moment, but it would be better to expand. I still don't know what I want to do next. Like a uh, backpack or house upgrade. I guess we'll just kind of see once we have the money. No rush. Oh my god. Okay, the directions are starting to pain me. I feel like they're worse today. <laughs> I don't know, I feel like it would just make a lot of sense if it like, just went whichever way you click, but... Yeah, I don't know. I guess not. I don't know, do you guys ever have an issue with the directions? Or is that a me thing? Because I guess I don't understand why you, you can turn some directions, but not others, I guess is what confuses me. Like, 
I don't know. How do you mean? Like, it just seems inconsistent with how you turn. Like, if I'm facing down right now, I'm clicking... Okay, I just went up, but, like, I don't know what it is that's making me do each turn. Like, I'm clicking over this way right now, but I'm not turning left. I'd go over here, clicking... Oh, there I turned. But that took, like, 20 clicks before I turned. Like, I'm clicking all about here. At some place I did, it just... It seems like, I don't know, you have to click very specific, or it's inconsistent, or... It just never turns as I would expect it to. Like, I would figure it, like, would make sense most... Or, like, feel-wise, I would assume, you know, click this way, you turn that way, click that way, you turn that way. Like, you know. Whereas it seems like you got to click in a very specific spot. Like, you've got to click it like, a specific part of the tile next to you, rather than just the general direction. I feel like it would just, like, feel-wise, it would make more sense to me to, you know, it to be direction-based of where you're clicking, like, screen-wise. Rather than, like, a specific spot on the ground. I don't know. The more you play it, the more you just probably get used to it, and so it doesn't come up, really. I don't know. I just... I still haven't gotten used to it. That's it. Like, it doesn't really cause many issues, just... Yeah. There was something in the patch notes about the downward stroke of the sword that was fixed. Oh, yeah, I think that's that's an unrelated thing, but I, I did see that, yeah. I never uh, noticed any difference, really, with that, but uh, so that's probably also something that I uh, haven't had as much experience with. Am I really full? Ay, ay, ay. Uh, magnets. I play with a controller, so no. Oh, right, right, yeah. You only turn in direction when your mouse is on one of the eight adjacent squares next to your character. Ah, uh, yeah. Which I guess, like, makes sense, but... I guess feel-wise, it, it feels inconsistent to me. Like, you gotta, like, hold... I don't know, yeah. It probably isn't actually inconsistent in terms of, like, code, but, like, in pure feel. I, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm just used to so many other games where it's not that specific, like... Because I feel like if I click here, that's the direction I should swing. Like, if I swing here, it makes sense to me that I would turn around. But instead I gotta click in here, like, really close to the character. Whereas said, like, you play this game enough, you probably don't think about it. But I guess, like, I still haven't gotten used to that, because I guess in so many other games, it's more like, yeah, if I click this way, I would swing that way type of thing. But yeah, I'm sure it's working correct and everything, it's just a feel thing. Oh, it's getting late. Oof. Yeah, no, I think especially with combat, was it like I'm not thinking as much? Like, I just want to be able to click up here and I'm clicking that way, but you got to click in like this really, you know, really specific range around you. Like, even here, like, I'm trying to click, you know, I'm trying to click that tile. I'm spam clicking all around, but I'm not turning upwards. But then, right then, I did. So it's just, yeah, I guess it's just, I guess it would feel better, like, if you could just, if it was, like, more than one block around you, 
to make the turn happen. Yeah, I don't know. So I don't know many, how many people like run into this as like an actual problem. Um, cause like it may not even be noticeable, like if you played this game for a few hundred hours, cause you're just so used to how it works type of thing. So maybe, uh, yeah, a lot less noticeable to a lot of, uh, veteran players who are just used to it. Uh, what else we got? Go, go, go. Have you uh, played a lot of Satisfactory uh, LK? I have no idea where I'm putting artifacts. They can go in here. Yeah. Ah. I do also wish you could uh, move your inventory around when you're in uh, in chest management. <laughs> Uh, that, that's also a feel thing, I guess. I always go to do it. No, I don't really feel, I guess, just... Quality of life? I don't know. Anyway, not a big deal. Uh, fishing rod, yeah. I guess I'll keep it on us. Yeah, I, def I definitely just need to get the next inventory upgrade, because I feel like these are taking up a lot of inventory at the moment. Squidding. Uh, I don't really have a place for you, Squidding. You can go in here. for you. Oh, right. I did want to look. Oh, yeah. There's energy and health. I see. I see. Not much. Like, only 50 energy. Like, compared to cheese, they're not very worthwhile <laughs> to keep them in versus selling. Right. No watering needed today. Very nice. Let's still smell a few more of them, if you want to expand. It is nice not watering. Oh, mushrooms. Oh right, I need to check the cave. I feel like I'm going to be forever forgetting about the cave. <laughs> Sometimes I didn't think of it, like on the forest farm map, but like, I would see it more often. Whereas it's kind of out of sight, out of mind on this one. Who have I missed? Augustus, where might you be? Oh, there you are. Definitely nice not having to buy hay. Though I guess we still kind of, yeah, we need to kind of keep a supply for uh, rainy days. Ah. What do you think you're doing? I need your milk. I pay switch to Steam Deck, but I think it would bother me if I couldn't just click in the general direction. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess if you're, uh, yeah, if you don't use mouse and keyboard, then it's, uh, non-issue. <laughs> oh, 
Oof, I feel like poop. Might be low energy today. Ah. Just have coffee. Lots of coffee. Definitely solve the problem. Maybe. Definitely maybe. Ah, hope you feel better though. Oh, I'm starting to get big milks. Uh, we need one of them, don't we? Yes. Let's set one of those aside. Good, good. Yeah, I guess we got to the mine a bit late yesterday. That seemed to go quick. Uh, I got stuff back out, but I, I really do want to complete the mine, so that's just kind of done. Yeah, something else we need to do right now. Arms covered. Wait on some taps. Try and get this done. Get a little bit more gold. But I, yeah, I don't know. I just have to try and get uh, used to it so I don't, uh, doesn't cause problems. The directions, I mean. But I can see that being a benefit of, uh, yeah, like Switch or Steam Deck type thing. Lol in screen chat. Sorry I put the word poop on screen for everyone. <laughs> no matter. Although you did do it again by saying that. <laughs> but either way, no matter. <laughs> Just funny. Alright, because yeah, we, uh, we get Skull Cavern access once we get to the bottom right. Well, that's what I meant to check. Uh, what is the recipe for bombs? Iron ore and coal, huh. They do seem really useful for Skull Cavern. Well, probably in general. Especially Skull Cavern. Critical? Nice. Oh, good bit of gold here. what I want to do after the uh, mine's complete. I'm just kind of thinking. Because there's a lot of things to do in terms of progress and oh, I'm just uh, not sure. Probably a bit still we want to do in the mine. Because we do need, still need more gold and uh, iron in general. We need more kegs. Probably do want to expand the crops if we can. I don't know, maybe, um... Because I feel like the, the inventory upgrade I want, but it's probably like most useful for the mine. So maybe if we're done with this mine for now, we can hold off on that. Because expanding like farm, getting more like, uh, well, I guess if we want to have more iron and go, call, uh, Iron and uh, copper. Sorry, I'm just like half thinking aloud here. 
as in expanding the crops and getting more kegs is probably the number one way to uh, get more money at the moment. Although, well, I guess those things don't cost, so yeah, because in terms of money too, it's probably best that we spend on upgrading the Cuban barn more than anything. Because animal products do seem like really good income. They're going to get wrinkled anyway. At least I got the washing machine wrinkles out. <laughs> good effort. That's true. They will get wrinkled anyway. Yeah, we might, uh... We might prioritize the first barn and kook upgrade over anything else. That might be the way to go. Because the sooner as we get, the sooner we get those, the sooner we'll have more money for things, and we can get like the inventory upgrade and house upgrade and stuff like a lot far, like without worrying. Never iron clothes. Only use an iron for arts and crafts. <laughs> okay. That works. But yeah, I don't bother. My clothes be however they be. Any other goodies before we go down? I'll we'll fight some slimes while we're here. Oh, that was just red rock, okay. Is it 110 we're going to? I really don't remember. Pretty sure it was that or 120 at least. Oh, they dropped a diamond, nice. Damn rock. Or you need to let me pass. Or you. Ay ay ay. Oh, nice. Oh, we better check those first. Come on, goodies. Iron, copper, yeah, that's something. Cave carrots. I'll trade you. Go away, bats. We have discussed many times how no one likes you. Just very inconvenient. Fine. Ay, ay, ay. You take up way too much time, bats. Make the days longer if you want to be around. Yeah. Something like that. Base boots. Oh man. The inventory pain. This is the bottom, right? No? Okay, it does go down further than I remember. Well, we made progress anyway. more iron. Oh my god, more bats. Why? I hate you so much. Do you understand? So much. We 
we let the wrinkles out? Let's say I know that tune. Where? Where do you like the bats that bring us fruit? This is true. Oof. I mean, hell, I'd, I'd be fine with the bats if they just didn't uh, get knocked back. <laughs> that would also be fine. That would be acceptable. Yeah, see, this is like, that, that, yeah. I feel like the directions are throwing me off more today. I don't know if something changed. I mean, they're fine. It's just, uh, I'm more aware of it today. <laughs> like, I mean, it's still not causing major issues. I'm just more aware of it. It's what I mean. Hello? Why you drop squid ink, man? It's very confusing. Very confusing. Song makes me think of the scene in Men in Black 2 with the dog barking at the radio. actually a pretty good amount of gold. Forty-four, not bad. A few more sprinklers if we want them. Okay, with some luck we can get down to 115. Oh, uh, we've got a few warp to totems, so I guess we can stay late too. Uh, inventory. You pain me. Alright, I'll take some geodes over that. Oof, getting exhausted too. Delicious cheese to the rescue. Ladder hanging around is there. No, but there's bats. Crap, come on. Ah, oh, pain. I want to pick things up. Mm. Nothing I want to drop, though. Uh, mushroom for geode, I guess so. Oh, -ho. save my totem. Good stuff. Arm. Quickly grab those. Oh, we're starting to get the star stuff. Ah, uh, but no, push it. Sell stuff tomorrow. Oh man, I missed the Wednesday recipe. Maybe Sunday, maybe. How are you, kitty? Okay, we've got a few things ready. We got wine, got blueberry jelly. I prefer jam. Oh, I guess in this case it is jam, huh? Right, America.
I see. Um, guess we still didn't finish the mine, huh? Hmm. Running out of space in places. More keg materials. This is good. Uh, copper iron. That's the one. Yeah, we're getting a bit low on iron, huh? We'll have to deal with that. We need another chest or something. All right, better fill those up. Uh, melons for the kegs. Peppers for the other. is done. Alright, I gotta make sure I watch out for those wiggly things too, huh? I feel like I just don't look at the ground is a problem. <laughs> chest for that too. <laughs> Animals. Hiding chickens. Let's uh, might do some wood chopping today. Alright, don't need to go in there. I knew that. This is... Yeah, I don't know. It's hitting me a lot more today. I'm trying to ignore it. <laughs> or just shut up about it. Either way. Both work. Got all... Milk machines going. Ah, oh. touche. Uh, I better go buy some more seeds. Chop some wood, I think. Really need more iron. Because iron equals kegs and kegs equals tasty drinks. Mm-hmm. I really like being able to pause so I can think. <laughs> well, we'll go get some seeds for now. Have you made a coffee yet, Mana? I have not. That would be nice, though. That would be nice. Uh, I don't know what we're going to get. Attempt to get more pumpkins. Um...
Yeah. Yeah, we'll get some more pumpkins. They're worth a lot. That'll be good. Might make one more sprinkler. And yeah, I think we'll just like do some wood chopping and this and that today. I do want to finish the mines soon though. Just so that's done with. Yeah, pumpkins take a while, but they seem like they're good value. How you doing, kitty? I'm busy. Three more. Yeah, why not? May as well. I mean, I guess the more the better. We just you need to do more mine stuff. We have some energy food now, so you can do some chopping without worry, which is nice. Uh, I feel like with the log, the mushroom logs are probably better off like resetting them up somewhere and like having like planting trees around them. I assume there's probably some sort of optimal way to do it. But still, it's probably better off like just plant a couple of each near them or something. I'm not sure what their range is. But we'll chop all these. So we're getting very low on wood. And we need that for kegs and house upgrade and probably other things I'm forgetting. Uh, forageables for this month. That's a thing. Is it just... Oh, right, because there's no winter crops, obviously, yep. So we've got the large milk. We just need a couple other things. Okay, so we need an upgrade for that. Those will come along. Okay. Oh, hello, mystery box. Is the mystery box thing new? Oh, hello, mystery box again. I assume it is new. Oh, hello, mystery box. How are you? Apparently the trees are filled with mystery boxes. Exhausted, no problem. Cheese fixes all. I remember what we like moved to after cheese. Oh god damn it. Why are you doing me like this mini pond? What did I ever do to you? I 
can't remember what we were using for energy food at the end of the last farm, or... Uh, something. Definitely something. We've pretty much got this second square uh, cleared up. Minus a few trees, but all the, like, the crap on the ground is pretty much gone. It's good. Oh, a few bits I missed. But yeah, I think we'll, um, yeah, set up an area for the logs somewhere, maybe. Mushroom logs, I mean. Yeah, I don't know, like, yeah, a couple of each type of tree planted next to them or something. Probably good. Inventory full. Seems to be happening a lot. Moss now. I don't know if we want to make more mushroom logs or not. I don't know if it's worth it. Need hardwood, so I guess not at the minute. Alright, we got a couple more sprinklers. Oh, right, I was going to do our uh, three more. for now. Yeah, I guess we may as well do some more this way. Yeah, I assume the mystery box came new because they're given out at the... Uh... Wait, where were they originally? Oh, I got it from that uh, trout festival, yeah. Oop, need fertilizer. Please be enough water. Thank you. One more. Uh, that is uneven, but I feel like that's probably good for now. Ah, one left. Oh, so you can hop around, but you can't change direction. Ah. That's slightly convenient. I wish you could cancel, though. Ah, I didn't realize you couldn't change the direction. Anyway, good, good. One more, I guess. Might as well make it even. Yeah. Why not? As for mystery boxes, um, put them in here for now. Not really sure what to do with those. Got 
I guess you can get them from chopping trees, so... We may end up with a fair few of them. I assume you can get them from various things, I don't know. Not sure what all you can get out of them. ton of stone do we because I want to get the coop and barn upgrades as soon as we can but we'll need more resources for that won't we right wait on them one more sprinkler oh forgot about them more jelly that is in fact jam Keep doing some of them. Um, might sell a few things. We might sell them. Bok choy. I don't know if that's worth just selling or. Let's sell the gold radish as well. It boosts us a little bit. I can go for some coffee? Question mark. I mean, thinking phase. Coffee does sound good. Oh, good stretch. Doesn't mean long, but apparently I need it. <laughs> oh, still waiting on the gold. Yeah, I should probably make coffee. Does sound pretty good. Rip the Stardew Valley board game that can't be updated to 1.6. Is that a... Wait, is that an actual problem? I'm not sure what, what else changed. I guess you can't drink mayonnaise in the in the board game. That could be a problem for psychopaths. Board game is physical. Oh yeah, I know, but like, uh, cause I assume you were probably joking, but like, I mean, depending on everything that changed, like that could actually like have inconsistencies now though, right? I don't know what all you can get in the board game, because yeah, that I just just yeah. Thinking there could actually be some inconsistencies now. Cause I mean yeah, like things like mayo is now drinkable, so. Hmm. I think that'll take too long, so we'll leave that one for the morning. Well, Chez is done. Hello Chez. Oh, he hello other chairs. How are you? They're all watered. Oh, I guess I might as well put that last one in there. Oh shit balls, it's 150. Okay, we if we do not land on our bed and we get charged, I will not be happy about that. <laughs> We basically could have fell on our bed from that close. Well, the radish has helped.
I had one cold pressed coffee with milk. Crustless egg tart with cheese and blueberries. Nice, nice. That do sound good. I could go for cold pressed coffee. That that does sound nice. Ah, I didn't get to uh fertilize that one. It was too close. Dang. No matter. Everything else should be watered. Fill up for just in case for later. All right, I will be back in just a moment. Kettle's on. I may even remember to make a coffee. Maybe. Anyone have any interesting board game stories as experiences? I can't say that I do. It's been many, 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 many years since I've played anything like that. All good, all good. Just purple emojis. Where are you chicken that? I can see like one of them. Oh, there you all are. Oh, hiccups. Oh, right. I can feel the silo now, can't I? Which actually, is that reliable? Like if I fill the silo and they have plenty of grass to eat, are they still going to be eating the hay? Because that'll just kind of be costing me for no reason, if so. Or will they pri prioritize the grass if available? I suppose I can do a small scale test if necessary anyway. I've got very little hay anyway. I get a little competitive on board game nights. I might walk around like a... Like a do a dance, like I'm in the end zone and shout in your face, maybe. <laughs> Seems reasonable.
I haven't played a board game in ages. I like them though. Yeah, I haven't in many, many years. Midair chest bump. Who <laughs> right. Well, enthusiasm is good. Mostly. Do some chopping. Oh my god, the grass. It's taken over. Well, we can do a bit more clearing of our areas. That'd be good. Oh, we need to make lightning rods still at some point. Yeah, we'll try and get this place cleared up a bit. My family and I used to play Monopoly. We don't play anymore. <laughs> Due to our uh, incidents? Oh. Monopoly can be interesting. Rid of some of these. Settles quietly back on cushion with hands folding lap, blinky politely. My extended family board game nights got a little intense. We steal each other's money or chips, so you'd have to take it with you if you got up. Ah, <laughs> that's rough. Monopoly was rough. That is indeed rough. I have a fond memory of hosteling around UK versus Ireland. I brought my Uno cards and played with people at the hostel. Oh nice, yeah. Probably more friendly than with family. Oof, need cheese. Your father used to hide Uno cards a lot. <laughs> Ah. I had a room with an Australian girl named Bronwyn and a German guy who taught them you know. Okay, nice. That's cool. Cleaned up here. I need grass though. Try and leave the grass and just clear everything else. Be good for once we actually want to use these areas. Grass will probably have taken over by then. I lay a draw four card down to apologize. The German guy goes, why? It is part of the game. It helps you win. Do you not say sorry? He was very serious. <laughs> that checks out. <laughs> that definitely checks out.
think that's uh, pretty good there. Growing trees and... Yeah, just growing trees and grass here now. Nice. This one's still a mess, but it's a start. Let's try and do the same here, which I think actually we're pretty good here. Oh, does this one actually respawn? Because we had a bunch around our area, but... They didn't really spawn. Maybe that one does. I'm pretty sure I chopped that. I think kettle's done, so I'm going to go make a coffee in a moment. Yes, that one respawns. Oh, okay. Is it just like literally that one? I guess that's something. Yeah, I think we'll knock these down and move them. Which, of course, I have no inventory space. Gonna need those upgrades. There we go. There we go. Ah, oh, inventory. It's always pain. In the kitty. Exactly. Uh, I'll drop one more while we're here. Got 66. This way should have a decent supply of wood. I'm gonna have to make sure to watch this fence, huh? I keep forgetting that fences crumble. trees nearby the better it works so I don't know what exactly that means like if it's purely like a number of trees or different trees or and if it's like does does different trees impact what mushrooms grow or is it purely that it makes it work faster hmm Like, if we just plop them here, will we get the same mushroom variety, but slower? Also, oh my god. The fruit cave exists. It's just completely, like, out of sight, out of mind for me down here. <laughs> uh... Thank you. Yeah, I guess between like that and the mushroom logs, you don't really need to, like it seems like the, um, there's no point doing the mushroom cave anymore, right? Like the mushroom logs seem to kind of take that place. Uh, all right, I'll be back in a minute. Just gonna make quick coffee.
And they're back. Thank you for waiting. Uh, I think we're good. I don't know they're about done. I'll put my jumper back on. Did you uh decide what you were gonna play this way? Oh, they're done. Yeah. Okay. Re jumped. Grab those. And then we'll head to bed. Uh, I don't think I'm forgetting anything. Uh, excuse me. Transmute. Never use those recipes. Are they very worth it? I haven't really paid much attention. <laughs> Booksellers in town? That might be worth checking since we have money, actually. Um. Okay, three copper to one iron. Two iron to one gold. Yeah. Guess you can't go backwards though, huh? Because I'd, I'd prefer it if you go backwards. It's like, yeah. To a degree. Like, you know, get like two copper for one and iron or something. All uh, right, yeah, we need lightning rods. Hmm. I want to get a bunch of them. How many bat wings do we have? 120, that's fine. We've got plenty of quartz. I'm still so confused about quartz being a one-to-one -one thing, though. That's, that's just broken my brain. Other than that, we just, uh, we need iron, I guess, for multiple things at the moment. We might need to head to the iron layers. Because we need a good chunk of iron. Don't know if I missed that there. Uh, that's all good. few recipes I don't use but for perfection you have to craft one of everything oh okay I see uh, tree you are kind of in the way there oh lug simulator did I read that Fire quartz is a better to furnace. Uh, what does it do? <laughs> is this valid information? Not that I have any, apparently. Chickens, where are you? Uh, which? Oh, yep. That was all. Thank you. 
Thank you. All oh, right. So the silo. Thirty-seven pieces of hay. Huh. I guess. Do silos come with hay? Oh, right. These ones don't... Right. Right. I forgot you gotta... They've gotta be upgraded to actually get hay from that, huh? Forgot about that. That is unfortunate. doing today. I feel like we may need to go get iron. Hmm. Cause yeah, I mean we need it for kegs. Need it for lightning rods. Need it for more sprinkles if we need them. And I guess yeah, if we're in the iron layers we can potentially get coal as well, which we need. Just in general. Uh, I'm gonna have to make another chest. That is, that is in fact not a chest. Kate, where do you expect to live now? Well, fine, you have a spot I guess. Yeah, I guess, uh, that's, yeah. We'll just use it as a dump chest, basically. That's fine. Fill the mine with cheese. Maple syrup, I guess I can bring you, I suppose. That's acceptable. Oh, right, bookseller, huh? Ay, ay, ay. Also coffee. Hmm, that's good. It's very good. You know, it really took the right way, but we'll get there. I like I took a very slow way to get here, but it's fine. It's fine. We got a sweet hat. It's all counts. Book of Stars. Read this to gain some experience in all skills. Hmm. That's does seem kind of significant. I don't know, I feel like the books are kind of interesting because, I don't know, does it, is it because it, di blah, blah. is it different now, like with, because level 10 isn't all there is to it, right? I didn't read the patch notes much, but there were some changes with that, wasn't there? Because I would think otherwise, that books are kind of expensive when it doesn't take that much to reach level 10 in skills. Hmm. Way of the Wind Part 1. Oh, I really do want that. I also really want the price catalogue. It just seems so useful. Because that's the kind of thing where you just like, you have to look everything up in the wiki or go to the shop. Like, I, I feel like that should just be a default thing, honestly, to be able to see prices. Hmm. What do I want to do? I honestly want to get the price catalog and the way of the wind. But damn, that's a chunk of cash for us right now. That's tough. That's tough. Hmm. The 
Queen of Source book is a game changer. I'm not familiar. I'm really curious like how significant that you run a little bit faster thing is. Faster movement speed is nice. Yeah, I'm just curious like what this is the equivalent of like because it says you run a little bit faster but is that like, you know, is that the same as plus one speed? Or is that like, you know, 0 0.5 speed or something? They added permanent movement speed? Yeah, yeah. And it's part one. So I assume there's more than one of these. More than one upgrade. But I don't know how much faster it is. It is a tough one. Hmm. I could go sell some stuff. It feels like I really want it, but it also feels like a very big investment at this point in the game. <laughs> uh, I mean, the book sale is pretty regular. Hmm. I might just get the price catalog and we'll get the way of the wind next time. Yeah. I am really curious what this means though. Like, I, I, I might actually check that. Because I, I don't know if it's the equivalent of like plus one or what exactly, you know, what the speed boost is. Um, yeah, you run a little bit faster. So there's two upgrades. First costs 15,000, next costs 35,000. Even the wiki is not clear. It just says, upon reading this, player's speed will be increased. But that's, you know, kind of non-specific. Because if it's the equivalent of like a plus one speed upgrade, and that would mean if you have coffee, you're in plus two, like that would be pretty significant on its own. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I wish I, I could tell. It's still probably, either way, it's probably better off waiting to the next one at the very least. I feel like the price catalog should be something that Lewis gives you after selling a few things. But 3,000 isn't that much after a while. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. It is a very useful feature, that's for sure. You learned a new power. Yeah, that is very, very nice to me. That is super useful. Ah, I really want Way of the Wind. I just, yeah. If I knew it was like a plus one speed, I would probably get it sooner. But it's just, it's too general. Uh, I guess we'll still go to the mine for a tiny bit. Yeah, we'll just get it like next time, I guess. There's probably better things we can put our money to at the moment. Like barn and coop upgrades. Which, speaking of... What do we need for those? Uh, okay. 400, 450 wood. 10k, 12k. Hmm, 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 hmm. 
Okay. I would like to get go. I mean, darks. Maybe we'll get that next. Yeah. 400 wood, 150 stone. Yeah. Okay. Actually, we might not worry about the mine today. Let's go back. We, we might get that upgrade going. I think we should have enough, maybe. Um, or close if not. Let's see, what do we got? Oh yeah, we're good enough. We'll get that going. Uh, I will grab this stuff back out for now. Or what we need anyway. Yeah, I think that'll be worth it. Have bit, we'll have a bit of money left over, we'll get some ducks. I forget how much ducks are, are they like 1500 or... 2,000 or... Remember. Yeah, we might do that. Oh, I guess it'll take a couple of days anyway, so... I'll have a bit more money by then. This one. Thank you. That knocked through most of our wood. Oh, our wood supply did not last long. <laughs> I don't know, has anyone got the um, speed upgrade book yet? Oh, right, I meant to put those on. Uh, they're all going. Uh, do, 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 do. I think we needed maple syrup for something. I know we put maple in that bundle. We do need oak. May as well do one of them. I feel like, do we need maple for something else? I don't know, the chef's... Oh no, we put them in for two different things. Okay, all good for maple then. Um, don't really know where to put that. Uh, I guess you can live here then. Sure. Alright, we have a couple of artifacts. Uh, large milk in that. Ready to get duck egg. Waiting on that stuff. Uh, I guess we should tap a pine tree and then we can complete that. Oh, alright, okay. Common... One mushroom and hazelnut. Uh, I feel like I picked up a hazelnut, or did I ignore it? Maybe I did. Uh, 
Oof, not that. Ah. Oh, wild plum. So what that is? That is that. I think there was a hazelnut down here then. Why did I put it somewhere weird? Because I thought I picked it up. Seen her hazelnuts. I definitely saw one. Among my million T trillion T installed mods and counting, I have CGB cheats menu and can customize my speed at will. Good because I have expansion packs and the world is large and in charge. Yeah, I imagine that would be uh, quite nice. I, I'm, I feel like that is a good addition because I the movement speed is like I do feel like it's very slow for how short the days are. Like you do get, I guess, kind of a quick travel system with the minecarts, which does help. But yeah. So no, do forage stuff like? Do they disappear if you don't pick them up? I could have swore there was a hazelnut, but I don't know what's happened to it. You have the same mod. Farm walks so slow normally. Yeah, I do wish the default run speed was uh, faster, which I guess those upgrades hopefully help cover. Yeah, I thought I picked up a hazelnut like along this section. Or saw, or I thought I saw one if I didn't pick it up. Hmm. I don't know. I am confused. What do you think, kitty? Did you steal my hazelnut? Is this what happened? Hmm. Suspicious. How are we doing here? All good. Couple spots I should really fill out. Hmm. Anything else we should sell? Well, for now, I'm just going to sell them. Some gold corn. I already put what I needed in for that, didn't I? Wherever that was. Yeah, I think that was a completer one, right? Yeah. But alright, we need blackberry and hazelnut. Which, uh, yeah, I thought we had blackberry. And the elusive hazelnut. those for now. Um, I guess we better chop some more trees. Pretty much all went to that upgrade. This area is still a mess compared to the other three. <laughs> Ugh, so many rocks and things. It's cleaned up a bit. Oh, 
Ah, oh, there's so much there. It's a pain. Not that it takes that much to clean it up, just it's a pain to look at. Oi, oi, oi. Trees, you are also pain. At least it's mostly one and done. Not too much at the end of each season. Now we'll just try and use that bit of energy before we sleep. Did you start a new playthrough again, uh, or new farm again, Jojo, or did you just add mods? Ah, oh, so many logs. Nice to be able to walk around when everything's clear. New farm, new character. Oh, okay, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm really curious about that speed upgrade now. I really want to know what it counts as. Cause I'm, cause I'm curious like how it also stacks with uh, coffee and stuff. Like if you have both speed upgrades and you have eel and you have coffee, is that like crazy fast? they stack that could be really good all right that'll do some mods I picked only trigger at the beginning oh okay gotcha gotcha Ah, they're done. Erm. Go, go, go. Very good. <laughs> I got the grandpa's farm type and a Bernese mountain dog and loads of witch clothing. Very nice. Just living my virtual life in my way. Yeah, for sure. It's a blackberry season right now. The bushes are full of them. I want to pick some, but I lost my basket. Can you help? Maybe, bud, but I did not see any baskets for like a year last time, so we'll see on that one. We shall see. I mean, where does, where does Linus lose a basket?
Oh, that's what I want to try. Grandpa's farm is so big. Oh, okay. Is that just like a specific farm type from Extended or? Cranberries are coming in. Uh, I better get some more seeds to start filling some of these gaps. Because I got money. Oh, ideas to sleep on. Good. Chickens, are you hiding? I see you there. Barely. Oh, hello. How are you? Smack in the wall. Cool, cool. I appreciate it. Always good to have a lady smacking on the wall. Don't think there's an innuendo there, but we'll see. Maybe. That eh, could be. If you're doing things right. To the PM man. Oh, it's berry day. Sir. Damn right. <laughs> Eyes. Sir. <laughs> So we get some more pumpkins going. Yeah, I mean, they could profit in the long term. Yeah, you know, longish term. Um. Yeah, I think I'll just stick with them. Let's get 50 of those. And screw it, I'm just going to buy it. Nice. Don't think, just buy. That makes money a future mana problem. <laughs> and current mana gets a nice new backpack. Perfect. Works for me. some more kegs, don't we? That requires iron. Hmm. Yeah, we'll definitely have to go to the mine sometime soon. Some more of these planted. More fertilizer. Kitty.
this will kind of do for now. I mean, it's a decent number of crops. It's not crazy. Not too bad. I mean, at the very least for now, it's making enough money and keeping us ahead. Egg juice. Good. Solid milk. Also good. I guess spread would be more accurate. Egg spread. Either way. Uh, what else did I get I wanted to sell? Oh, yeah. I think I'll sell those and... Sell them as well. That'll be good. Uh, is a bit more bok choy. I don't know if I want to make space somewhere for these pumpkins. But I guess they go, what are they, 12, 13. Okay, so we've got a few days before that's an issue. Such a calming game if you're not in the skull cavern. <laughs> True. Excuse me, kitty. We'll jump to the mine. Don't need a hazelnut wherever they are hiding. Hmm. I'm still confused about how I saw one and then it's not there unless they do disappear and I. I'm just unaware of that. We need iron, but it would be good just to get this uh, finished. Then we can go to the uh, skull caverns when we want to. Well, minus the bus, right. Oh, it's the vault, ugh. Money. Well, it gets us one step closer to Skull Caverns then. Might be a while though. Either way. Good to get her done. Oh, but bats. Why? Why do you have to exist? This is this I want answers to. I guess that's a nice thing about playing modded games. You could just delete them. That'd be pretty nice. But I like vanilla. Although bats, the bats definitely take away from that calming aspect also. <laughs> At least to me. Terrible. This seems to be an issue with multiple farm sims. This is a dinkum problem too. Ay, ay, ay. It must be 120 that's the end, right? I, I do not remember. I remember this, like, these layers, but... I guess I didn't really come back to, like, the, like, deeper levels after I finished it last time. So I don't really think much about it. Oh, 
Hello again, Simply Adia. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Good time zones. Oh, need cheese. Bat, stay away. No? Of course not. Why would you do such a nice thing? What's with the red mist? Does it just like attract the bats? Just bat time, huh? Sure. Why not? I guess I can use your wings for something. About the only saving grace. Terrible. Probably worse than Dinkum, but I don't know. They're getting close. Oh, you little shit. Damn magic men. At least they don't get knocked back. They're redeeming. Good. Oh, go away. Why can't you be like Helmet Man? Well, at least we're getting more gold. Even if you have to deal with bats. Play magic man. Come on. Bye. Thank you. You found the skull key. You're not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. Very good. Now, can I have some iron, please? I'll take screenshots of my fanatical world, complete with dragons. Sounds, uh... Unique. And slightly dangerous. Would you like to become stairs? Nope. Hmm. Just wanted some easy iron. Iron? Mm, very small amount of iron. And that's... Oi, oi, oi. Well, I'm nothing if not unique. No, well, unique is good. Unlike bats. This quartz is good too. Ooh, iron, yes. That's what we want. I don't even mind the uh, the ghosts. They get knocked back, but they're slow enough that you can do things in between. Thank <laughs> you. 
They also drop gold sometimes, apparently. Also good. Ooh, coal bag. Nice. I don't know who's carrying around these bags of coal, but... Ah, uh, useful. Oh, is this bat time too? some copper too. Oh wait, go away. It's like no bat mod. That'd be the best mod. Don't even need to add anything. Just take the bats away. <laughs> Away, Cole. How do you do that? I think that's gonna about do us. Uh, I was gonna warp totem, but we might be good. Just and bed. Uh, can we drop a few things off? Dwarf scroll three. Um, not sure if it's on that one. Oh, either way. Hello, kitty. Oh, level 10 farming. Artisan, absolutely. That's a huge, yeah, 40% is so, like, that is a huge difference. I've never had anything good drop from about, I support the mod. That sounds pretty good to me. One week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley Fair in the town square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from all across the country to a humble town. If you'd like, you can set up a garage display for the event. Just bring up to nine items that best showcase your talents. You'll be judged on the quality and diversity of your display. The fair starts at 9am, don't miss it. I still question the word grange being real. Grange, grange. Dear Mana, thank you for purchasing a coop upgrade. In addition to doubling the capacity of your coop, I've taken the liberty of installing an incubator. To use the incubator, simply place an egg inside. If you have space left in your coop, the egg will hatch in several days. As always, thanks for your business. Robin. Very good. Yeah, I guess we gotta have nine items set aside. Oh, and we can get a, uh, we can get a star drop from that too, can't we? That event. If I'm recalling correctly. Which sounds very nice. Oof. Uh, something like that. Is, it, is that the event with those, like, uh, the fishing and shooting minigame? I think that was the one, right? Add some more melon.
I need to get the mods for different animals. Do you, uh, do you use a lot of mods, Kelly, or mainly like the extended one, or...? Get some iron going. Yes to the games at the fair. Oh, okay, nice, nice. And that Wheel of Chance thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just remember the, uh, the shooting game. That was pretty good. That was, a uh, very easy, uh, tickets. Or coins or something. Either way, I uh, I did pretty well at that. Um, what am I doing? Milk. Want the dragons? Was that on the fifteen, sixteen, something like that? Okay. Took a bit of time for then. Oh, it's preserved been not going. Whoops. Have a berry. Kitty, are you sleeping again? Oh, hello. Do you need water? Also fill your bowl? Those down. making iron for all oh, right kegs kegs how much have we got uh, all right we got four oak that'll be good I think I need to get more iron though. Oh, the map is different. I guess the, um, I get, cause the, uh, before the, the mod that adds, um, what do you call it? Um, adds NPCs onto here. It used to also update it so your position was where it should be, like they changed in 1.6, but it also like redid the map. I guess they removed that since 1.6 added it, but uh, I definitely preferred the modded one. <laughs> this looks so like dead. Whereas, uh, if you recall, the, the mod version was, uh, more orange. Which, I don't know, maybe it's more accurate, but... It looked so nice before. Yeah, I, I guess this mod only does the positions now, rather than... Uh, positions, your actual position, and the... The map display change, because it was made to be more accurate, too, but... Yeah, I guess it was updated in 1.6, so it's not necessary now. Damn, I had not looked at that in full. That does not look great. I mean, it might, I guess it's accurate. Just, it's so, I don't know, yellowy, browny color. It was all like vibrant and like orange and before. It looked so much, it looked nice. Huh. I've expanded in the cheats menu. Oh, okay. Not sure. I also have the Stargy Druid. Averia's Dragons. Averia's Dragons? 
I like that the map changes seasons now. Yeah, that was, um, that's like the one mod I had, um, cause I've been playing vanilla for, cause still pretty new to it. But the one mod that I got was so you could see NPC, posi NPC positions on the map. Um, but that mod also did make it so it changed in the seasons as well as a uh, fixture position. But yeah, the mod version of this was like, it was all orange and vibrant. It looked really nice. Uh, but it is good that they changed that in the core game. But I feel like, yeah, the, the other map I had was a lot nicer looking. <laughs> yeah, I've definitely preferred the orange. The, uh, the winter map looked really nice. I, I'm curious to see what that's like. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, we kind of need to chop some wood again. Oh, wait, that's, that's done upgrading. Oh man, I didn't get to the, I didn't get the rest recipe on Sunday. Uh, missing so many, which is very unfortunate. Well, at least I get some berries. Quite a few berries. Yeah, I don't know. The, I feel like here looks like so much nicer than this. I, I'm not a fan of this map. <laughs> this is at least kind of like vibrant and nice and there's like an orangeness to it. Whereas this is just like... This, yeah. I, I think the mod version was definitely nicer. Because I feel like even though like this is meant to be like, you know leaves dying and falling kind of season thing like this still feels like it's full of life this does not feel full of life but uh berries are good oi 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 I can't even walk through this place. Oh, good few berries. Now, we need ducks. Oh, God damn it. Why? Why? Ah, <laughs> uh, the pain. Why you gotta be most days? Why can't you have a nice schedule like most people who operate a business? I mean, they probably are still on the schedule, but why, why say most days? Why not give me dates? Oh yeah, yeah. I don't think I ever opened my map after spring one, but now that the NPCs are on it, it makes it easier to find them for gifts. Oh, are the NPCs on the map now, or? Oh, you meant with the mod. Cause uh, that is still a mod, I, th I think. I don't know, I added them. I added it, but I don't know if that was already changed. That was just the one mod I had to put uh, NPC locations on. But I don't know if they updated for 1.6. Because I feel like it's a very vanilla friendly thing. In general. But I guess even then I don't open the map very often. It took me like a week into fall to uh, even open it. Oh, that's done. Nice. Oh, I didn't know it was a mod. I thought 1.6 had it by default. I didn't read all the patch notes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think that, um... Yeah, because the mod used to be, like, three things in one. It was the locations, the season changes, and your correct position. 
I think 1.6 has the correct position and season changes now. Uh, I don't think they have the, um, yeah, the NPCs. I think they just added the, uh, yeah, season changes and correct position of your character. Well, not correct, but, uh, accurate. Uh, good, good, good. But yeah, the NPC positions, I think it's really, it's a good mod, like, so I'm trying to play, well, I am playing vanilla other than literally that, but I said, I, I feel like it's very vanilla friendly. Uh, let's chop a little bit of grass. That's better. More melon wine going. I'll stop listing my mods. <laughs> You're fine. Oh, whoops. Didn't put those on. Mostly keeping up. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just grab some stuff out of here when we're doing that, uh, festival. Yeah, I mean, I guess as long as there's like nine gold things, I'll probably cover it. That'll be good. Uh, what have I got going on here that I've been ignoring? Ask it. Right, Marnie wants Amareth. Well, maybe if you were open, I could do that. All right, Jordan wants a hot pepper. Demi wants a melon. All right, Pam wants a pale ale. I should I should get on that, I guess. Mana, does Taz change colors in fall? Are there deciduous trees? Ah, uh, deciduous trees. Um, I mean, somewhat changes color, but not really enough to notice, I feel like. Yeah, it's it's not really that noticeable. Like, there are plenty of trees that do shift, but like... Yeah, I feel like it's, uh, yeah, not really that noticeable. Like, you're not really going to go out and suddenly it's a big change or anything. If you live near enough of enough trees that do, maybe. But yeah, like, it's not like, uh, yeah, doesn't really register to me. But uh, there, there are certain, like, you know, larger trees around that do have big shifts, but yeah. Uh, deciduous trees? I have no idea what that means. So, maybe, maybe. After I Google that, I will tell you. Oh, it sheds its leaves annually. Um, yeah, th there is some, but it's, yeah, kind of the same answer. Like, there's not really enough to notice that much. Yeah. It's kind of like, I think it's probably like, it's just kind of, um, yeah, it depends where you are and what kind of trees you have near you, really. But uh, I wouldn't say, yeah, which I mean, it's autumn here. But, um, yeah, I wouldn't say it's very significant here in general. Probably more noticeable to very, like, specific people living kind of out and about with a lot of trees around them type of thing. But yeah.
Not that noticeable to me. What about, uh, what about near you? Hmm, what do we want to actually get next? Probably the barn upgrade, huh? And some ducks if someone decides to work. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, we got duck money at least. What's the melon wine? Damn. Melon wine goes for a thousand? Well, that ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Oh, rain day. I've got a new item in stock. It's called the Auto Grabber. This thing can milk your cows and goats, shear your sheep, and gather eggs, and pluck your woolly rabbits all on its own. Mm -hmm. It's considered a luxury item, so I'm charging 25,000. Money. Well, I'd consider it if it, if I didn't need more than one. Interesting, yes. Yeah, so I only got like three common mushrooms just then, so I guess the trees might make a big difference. Hmm. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Um, yeah, I was gonna say, um, yeah, I feel like in general here, like the, the seasons changing honestly doesn't change that much. Like there's more sun in summer. It's colder in winter. But like in general, there's like not that much like, yeah, it just doesn't register that much here. I mean, it's like, well, it's obviously warmer in summer and colder in winter, but it's like, we don't hit extremes on really anything. So it's, you know, season to season just doesn't change that much here other than really, yeah, the colder in winter and hotter in summer, like, and the rest of the year is kind of just in the middle. Uh, what am I doing? I guess, uh... Oh, I guess we need hay, don't we? Can you actually take hay out of the silo? How is there more hay? I don't remember putting more in. Hello, Flight. Let's come see you. Hope you're doing well. Oh. Uh, if my rare seeds get hit by the lightning, I will be... I will not be happy. Um. Right, do I have hay somewhere? I should do. I don't recall putting more hay in. Um. Wait, does it just go in the silo? Wait, does that just automatically go into the silo? Is that a thing? Apparently that is a thing. Oops. Can you get hay out of silos or no? By my clicking various buttons, I'm guessing no, which that is super inconvenient. Because it's just kind of like stuck there if you don't have deluxe. Hmm, okay. Guess we're going to Marnie's for hay and ducks. Both good. Um, yes, uh, Dragon's Dogma 2 is so awesome, and the microtransactions are easily ignored. We diff don't difficulty at all. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, glad to hear it's awesome. How's, uh, how's performance been for you? Seems like some people have been having, uh, 
pretty rough time with crashes and things. And then uh, other people, like, no issues at all. I've seen a few people who, like, couldn't play at all. Or uh, apparently cities are pretty rough on some people. Some people seem to be having no issues at all, though. Well, it seems a bit, a bit all over the place. But I'm glad you're enjoying it. Okay, the 1200, okay. Donald? Daffy? Scrooge? How do you spell Scrooge? Yes, it is. Okay, that's all the ducks that I can think of. Does someone want to name a duck? Need one more duck name. We've got Donald, Daffy, and Scrooge. You can buy the barn or coop in the output thingy, except you can't for the max barnacle coop. Just make sure you take it out before filling up where you put the hay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Yep, yep, gotcha. Waddles again, please. How the duck? Oh. It's like Jojo beat you by, uh... Well, by almost nothing, actually. Both of your messages is, came in at 4.12.27. But Jojo's came in first. <laughs> so it wasn't even a millisecond difference. But apparently if we're breaking down milliseconds, Jojo got Waddles in first. <laughs> Dewey, Dewey, or Louie. <laughs> well, uh, I think we'll be going... Well, we'll go Waddles. Because they usually just go first. But, uh... We may need more in the future. Waddles is cute. I've noticed zero performance issues. No lag, no crashes, nothing. Oh, you're lucky then. That's good. I mean, I'm sure a lot of people haven't, but uh, it seems like, a, yeah, it seems really all over the place. So I wonder if it's like specific cards and things that are having issues. I don't know. Because, yeah, I saw like some people, like they literally couldn't play. They were like crashing constantly when they tried to like create their character and stuff like that. So I don't know if it's like certain settings or like what's going on. But uh, that that is good to hear then. Yeah, some people, I've seen some people, like, having issues with cities mainly, like, uh, like big FPS drops. But, uh, yeah, I had, in, in the other side, I, I'd seen, um, other people having just no issues at all. Oh, wait, I filled it right. I assume you meant this thing. Oh, yeah. Wait, is that something you can move? No? You can just smack it? Fair enough. Yeah, I think, um, I think one of the mistakes they kind of, well... 
temporarily may have made with um, Dragon's Dogma 2 on consoles is like, it seems like maybe they would have been better off locking at the 30 FPS. Because like 30 FPS locked is like fine, like it feels completely fine. Whereas like, if you're getting like 30 to 40 to 50 and it's bouncing around, it ends up feeling worse than if it was just 30. Because if it's consistent 30, like, it feels fine. I mean, I'd much prefer 60, obviously, but, like, you know, like, it, it locked 30, you kind of just, you get used to it, and it feels fine. But I think people have had, like, a more noticeable experience on consoles because it's not locked, so you'll get, like, well, actually, it's unlocked. So they'll be ranging from 30 to 60, which uh, ends up being, yeah, noticeable in comparison. Whereas if they locked it to 30 until like patches or something, I think that would have been maybe a smarter move. But I don't know. Because I think 30 plays fine, but 30 to 60 doesn't feel good. 30 feels better than, yeah, it's, it's kind of weird like that. Consistency at a lower frame rate tends to feel better, is what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, forgot to put them on. But uh, at least you're not having any uh, issues. That is, uh, that is good to hear. Because, yeah, I, w I wonder if there's, like, some issue with some cards or, like, uh, some setting or something. Because I, I don't know why it's so all over the place. I did see, um, I think ray tracing was causing crashes for some people. So maybe, like, uh, some people are using things like that that, um, aren't quite there yet. But, uh, at least with a lot of the performance stuff, I, um, it'll probably get smoothed out pretty quick, I'm sure. Um, what am I doing? How, um, how are you liking, like, the story side of it so far? Anything uh, good to report there? Though I think it's probably more gameplay focused, but good story is always nice. Sorry, I'm going a bit slow here. Um. I guess we'll just keep, we'll keep a little bit of hay out in here for now. You know what I think? I think some people saw early reviews, heard of the issues, then complained about said issues. But if we're never told, we'll never know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. With some things, probably. Um, I've seen quite a few, um... Yeah, I guess it depends on what it is, though. Because, I mean, like, obviously, if there's performance issues, you want to kind of know about it, but then... Yeah, I guess, I guess it depends. Uh, I don't know what I want to put in them now. Um... Eh, some corn, maybe. Why lock it? At times it's more than 30. I'm not seeing a charge. Oh, not on PC. Not on PC. Um, with consoles. Um, and the only reason to lock it is just because, like, because 30 FPS is fine. Like, if you play a game at 30 FPS and it's just that's what it is, it generally feels good. Whereas people tend to... It, it just it feels worse if it, like, bounces. Or maybe an option would be better, more so. Not necessarily, like, force it. And I'm only speaking about consoles, obviously, on PC, whatever. Um, but obviously it's still better as, like, yeah, an option. Because if you're just, like, consistent 30, that feels good. If it bounces, like, from 30 to 37 to 40-something, then back to 30, like, people tend to notice it more, like... It, it just, uh, in a feel way. 
Um, but obviously it's better to have a, have the option rather than force it either way. Uh, what else is I going to do? They're fine. Yeah, we need more wood, don't we? That's what. Yeah. Mm. Still waiting on trees down here. Fantastic. And I just found a secret village that up my magic from about 220 to 610. Oh, nice, nice. That, uh, that should make a big difference. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm definitely looking forward to playing it in the future. I just, uh, don't have $108 to drop on a game at the moment. <laughs> I was really hoping it would go game pass, but that did seem unlikely. But yeah, a bit much for me at the minute. I'll play it at some point. Probably be a while though. <laughs> on PS5? Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, you can add arachnids as a barn raised creature mana. Seems your vibe. Oh, really? <laughs> Sounds interesting. Definitely interesting. <laughs> I wonder what the mod support will be like for Dragon's Dogma. I feel like if there is any sort of modding, people are going to get very interesting with that. <laughs> yeah, hopefully I'll be able to get it in uh, sometime in the next few months. Sure. Games that are releasing at more than $100 these days is uh, rough. Nice when they go to Game Pass though. Like Persona 3 Reload did. That was good. Really hoping Shin Megami Tensei 5 uh, Vengeance goes to Game Pass since it's Atlas. Because that'll probably be 100 or 100 plus. I wonder how many people are playing it on uh, Steam. Because it wasn't on Steam charts for some reason, was, which was weird. Cost me every cent I have, but worth it. Oh, that's good. Well, the being worth it part anyway. What are the uh, party members like? Is there much like interaction or anything there or? What are we at? Uh, a few more, a couple more. At least most of our area is clear now. Minus a few bits and pieces.
Oi, oi, oi. So much grass. I feel like the grass is just going to absolutely take over. I'm assuming uh, you don't go with uh, that option, Jojo. <laughs> I don't know, do they, uh, I guess what, would you get, like, silk or something? Hmm. And asleep. Maybe we could wait for when it goes on sale. Yeah, it'll be a while before it goes on any sort of decent sale, I reckon. <laughs> Mail? What do you want? Oh, cake. How are things going? You must be really making a fortune on the farm. Don't forget your dear old mother when you're a millionaire. Love, Mum. Oh, thank you. Pink cake, huh? Good stuff. Oh, they're done. Slot those in. Tempted now. Hello, Jake. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Have you uh, had a chance to play any more uh, 1.6? Uh, good. Oh, corn. Try to get the corn. What about the 11th? Okay, so we've got a few bidets, and then we'll just plant any of these we can't fill in. Uh, running out of space again. Um. Guess we just need another chest. How you fist bump your pawns in between fights? It's the little things. Oh yeah. That's cool. Is it much like uh do they talk much or is it I forget how it was in Arisen. No, I mean the first Dragon's Dogma. Dark Arisen. I don't think there was much interaction, because I think there was something I hoped there'd be more of in the next one. Yeah, a little bit. We chose a new farm. Oh, okay. How are you, uh, how are you liking that? Certainly keeping a head on grass in here. Oh god, how am I gonna find the ducks? Now, apparently there was one there. Oh hello. Apparently there was one there. 
Seriously, how the hell are you supposed to find ducks in this grass? Oi, oi, oi. Bad enough finding the brown chickens. Feels me. Feels me to your bone. At least I can check this now. Okay, Waddles, where are you at? Are you Waddles? Hello, Waddles. I like that it comes with the Cuban chicken. It's already fenced in and everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it seemed like it was a very, like, ranch-focused uh, kind of one, which I like, but... It didn't seem to have a ton of space for stuff, but... Probably depends how creative you get. Hey, but I did, I did like it in general, just, uh... Yeah, if it was a bigger area, I probably would have went with it. But uh, it feels like kind of farm I'd want to play at some point, but just not for my kind of main one. But uh, I imagine especially for people who have played a lot of Stardew and stuff, it'd be a, a nice change of pace. And especially if you want to focus on more of like a ranch type of thing. But yeah, it is a big advantage come with the chickens and coop, like... It does take a bit to kind of get there at the beginning. It's a good, good money saver. Well, and money maker. Or a food option. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like the actual uh, design of the, um, the Meadowlands farm looks nice. Um, what am I doing today? Hmm, I need a drink. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I mean, we can always get the barn upgrade. I wouldn't, well, hmm, yeah, probably wanted to get that next. Do we need a bit more wood? That would be good though. It's a really nice bit, I see the prices now. Really convenient. So we've got like a lot of money sitting here potentially. Let's sell some of those. Um Yeah, I mean if we sell those and chop a bit, we can get the barn upgrade. Yeah, that'd be good. All right, we still have berries around. Oh, there's the elusive hazelnut. Curious about the chatter of DD2 versus BG3 and what people are preferring and why. Hmm, I guess they're like, they're very different experiences, I guess. I imagine that'd probably be more uh, dependent on the person than uh, quality of each game.
Because I feel like Dragon's Dogma is more of a... Mm, it's more like, I mean, it's... I feel like it's closer to like a Skyrim type RPG, even though it's like, it is quite different, but like, it's... It's more like that than a CRPG, Baldur's Gate type of thing. Well, yeah, I mean, it's, yeah. It's more regular Western RPG than it is CRPG. To a degree. Yeah. I don't know, I'm just thinking aloud a bit here. <laughs> All right, I did need to sell, didn't I? And I missed the TV yesterday. That is once again unfortunate. It's like four or five uh, recipes I've missed so far today. Shouldn't cut down trees in town, but I can smack it for moth, huh? I see. I see. Okay. That's fine. I will chop here. Although I don't know if I have enough time. Is it 450 for the barn? It was, wasn't it? I think it was 400 for the coop. Might be cutting it a bit close. Although this is the most days place, isn't it? So I don't even know if they're there. Damn business model. Probably shouldn't even be getting the berries, but... Ah, it's already 4.30, damn it. Actually, just give me 20. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Okay, we can make it work. Oh, you shit. Oh, go back to the desk. Ah. Literally like two seconds off. I blame Robin. Couldn't even work a second overtime. Ay, ay, ay. Terrible. Don't even want to take your services anymore. I'll find a new carpenter. Better get a bit of extra wood. Here's a trick, Mana. When Robin is near proximity in where you interact with the cash register, you can open a shop menu up. Oh, can you? Oh, okay. Damn. But good to know. <laughs> she enters the house at eight, and that's when her house closes me things. So you have a second chance. Oh, okay. Uh, I can try. I mean, worth a shot. Okay, yeah. I mean, worth a shot. Why not? Me. How's the farming business going? It's corn season, isn't it? I can imagine it being pretty peaceful working outdoors with plants all day. 
yeah, it's pretty good. Oh ho! Nice, nice. Meaning I have enough stuff. Very good. I'll start working on the barn upgrade first thing in the morning. You best. You better do that. I see how it is with your 5 p.m. Well, can't really blame you when everyone else around it seems open to 4. Still, though. But, good call, good call. Yeah, it's interesting it's like not programmed to be like a set kind of, you know, it's kind of weird, yeah, it's weird that that works. Oh, it didn't fill up those kegs. Good, good. Yes, good call, Sway, good call. Still blame Robin, though. With her most days. What, like, what, where, when did this become normalized around here? Write your days, man. Go there. We are definitely low on a uh, wood and stone now. <laughs> but we can get goats, so that's good. That works. Those are all bopping. Oh. oh, good stretch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Rooster, I'm up. Ay, ay, ay. So loud at 6 a.m. Any corn? Yep. Anything else? I think we're good for today. Uh, a couple days left on those. Damn you, why are you out of sync? Alright, I'm just gonna leave that one until it's in sync with them. Much easier. A blueberry jelly that is in fact jam does look pretty tasty though. Good eight. How are you? Have some water. Oh god damn it. I gotta try and find the ducks again. This is not realistic. Why you gotta make me find ducks? They just completely disappear in the grass right now. <laughs> ay ay ay. Good, stay out of the grass. Okay, I caught three of them. The other, gone forever. And where are you, chicken? Look at look at them hiding. Oh yeah, yeah. Found you, Waddles. I'm just assuming it's Waddles. Yeah, 
Damn ducks. Good there, right? Yeah. Okay. Kitty, what do you think you're doing? How are we looking in our areas? This section is all good, minus the trees, which is good. Cleared all the wooden stone. Oh, new ideas to sleep on. All oh, right, so I hit the I hit ten farming, didn't I? So is there something beyond that now, or I thought there was like something that more that came with one point six. I don't remember what I read in the patch notes though, because I only skimmed them. But I thought there was something more to skills now. I like how them purple trees look, or if you'd call that purple. I don't know, even when like it's meant to be like dead grass, it just there's so much life compared to this. This needs a change. I don't, I really don't like that map. It doesn't matter, it's purely visual, it doesn't cause any problems, just the mod version definitely looked a lot better. I believe you have to spend skill points to get really good items in the area. In the new area. Oh, okay, a skill point. I mean, I don't even... Is that to do with this thing at the bottom? I'm not even sure what that would be. Like, there's no skill point slot, or is that just something that comes up later once you access new area or something, maybe? I thought maybe they would have, like, when it, when there was mention of it, uh, before there was patch notes or anything, like, I thought maybe it was going to, like, upgrade it to be, like, level 15 or 20 skills or something, maybe? Because, I mean, it is really easy to hit level 10. Like, especially when you hit, like... I mean, you can easily hit multiple level 10s within your first year. So I really thought maybe it would upgrade to like level 15 or 20 being the max. Because I, I don't know, I feel like I would feel a lot more satisfaction out of these being a bit more long term, like, because they don't really feel that significant, they're just kind of a quick means to get like the you know, the skills in between, like, the actual levels don't really mean that much when you can achieve them so fast. Mostly clear over this side, too. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, I think all the, like, the, uh, random bits are gone. I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wrong. 
There's a new mastery point system once you've maxed all of your skills in which you could spend. Oh, okay, wait, so you've got to get level 10 on all skills first? Okay. That's rough. <laughs> it's so easy to get like mining, foraging and farming. I mean, I guess I still don't take that long, but fishing for me is a rough one. Hmm. Okay. I see, I see. Go there. Um, all right, I want to go. I want to go to the community center. Where the hell did that acorn, I mean, hazelnut, end up? Okay, I definitely picked up a hazelnut. I actually remember it this time. Where the hell did I go? Oh, okay. Checks out. We'll go pop those in the community center so we can complete at least one. Our sweet hat stands it stands out even better in fall. Good stuff. Hello, Lewis. Mr. Shorts in places they shouldn't be. All oh, right, we have multiple of those we could have. Ah, damn. It's fine. Once a pumpkin's done, we can complete that one. Very good. All seeds, huh? Okay, okay. Man, that would be complete if I just grabbed that damn purple mushroom <laughs> from the uh, the mine. Winter forage and one of them, so that'll be easy done next month. All seeds. I guess we'll uh I guess we'll plant them. Hmm. Yeah, it might be worth just tilling out like an extra area for what we have on us. Yeah, as well. Um but yeah, if you gotta max all skills for that, I guess uh gonna, gonna have to spread the focus around, huh? I feel like, yeah, the, uh, the first three come a lot more naturally and then gotta go out of your way for fishing and combat a bit more. Yeah, I might just like till a part down here or something, just a three by three. Why not? Uh, as well. Oh, 
Oh my god, I guess there's a new fun bit. If you place a crafter staircase in Lewis's house, let's do it. Oh, a bit if crafted. Okay. Interesting. I didn't know you could just place... Can you just place things in people's houses? Or is that a very specific thing? Um, I guess no point, uh... Yeah, I guess no point fertilizing those, because I'll go to wine, huh? Was that just like in the patch notes? I didn't recall seeing that, but I... I did skim them. Not that I have the stone for such things. Really need to get some more stone, huh? Yep, yep. What am I doing? Watering. Would be nice if I had stone. He's 99, right? Yeah. I have like 26. Is there like a fast way to get stone? Or is it... I mean, I guess just going... I guess just rushing through the mine, going for those big ones. more. We can probably just slot them in around. Because yeah, I would make one if I had the stone. <laughs> I am very stone poor right now. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, there's a little mine I can get some from. But yeah, I guess rushing through and just going for the larger stones is kind of the way to go. What do you get from them? Two each. Not that much. That's some of them. Got us thirty nine. That that is a something. <laughs> uh, haven't often really had stone issues. Ran out of wood a lot, but less so with stone. Hmm. What are we at? Oh, low energy eleven. That is probably time to sleep. We are slowly kind of filling up this area. We probably... Well, I guess our animals are still over there. Might have to start utilizing the uh, four corners a bit more. 
Yeah, yeah, I know it's light. Foraging level seven. <sighs> Tree fertilizer. And that sounds like rain. And uh, I think we'll probably have to about call it here today, unfortunately, guys. It is 5 a.m., so a little bit earlier than I would like, but I am quite tired and I should really get some more sleep. So a little earlier is uh, probably the way to go. And I appreciate you all hanging out as always. I didn't realize it was that uh, late already until I looked not long ago. No wonder I'm so tired. <sighs> ay, ay, ay. Yeah, well, uh, we'll have to check out that staircase thing uh, next time. So, uh, if you think of it, please do remind me. When we have stone again. Oh, a purple mushroom from the log there. Nice. We needed that. Thank you for the stream. Thank you for being here, Jake. Thanks for the great stream as always. Thank you for being here, Sway. Thank you for stream, Anna. Thank you for being here, Jojo. Yeah, well, uh, we got a bit done today. We got our coop upgraded. Our barn is uh, underway. Got a decent amount of crops going with sprinklers. Nothing fancy, but doing the job. Money's uh, starting to pick up. We got our backpack upgraded. We uh, got the catalog thingy. We'll um, probably get the house upgrade next. Cause that'd be good to get. Hopefully get some recipes at some point. I didn't uh, get a single one today. Yeah, I got the purple mushroom there, so that'll complete another bundle. That's good. Yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. I am going to hopefully get some sleep. Well, hopefully get an actual good amount of sleep, more specifically, but... Either way... Yeah, be well everyone. Hope you have a good rest of your day. Uh, not sure what we're doing tomorrow night yet. But, uh, something. Hopefully. Uh, I won't be locking in tomorrow night actually yet. I'll, I'll see on that. I, I'm hopefully going to be streaming. Um, uh, but I'm probably going to have a busy day. I've got some family stuff at some point in the afternoon. So I'll have to see, but I reckon I'll be streaming. Just, uh, I'm just not certain as well. But I, I will be aiming to. Yeah. Thank you guys again. Thank you to anyone who's been lurking. I appreciate it. We'll, uh... Yeah, we'll, I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll see. Uh, if not tomorrow night, obviously the next night. But, um... Yeah. I'll, I'll be aiming to stream tomorrow night. Just not able to say 100% yet. And... Rain. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. <laughs> Probably. But that's fine. Just uh, be well, everyone. Appreciate you all being here. And yeah. I'm just very tired. <laughs> And, um, yeah, I don't know, well, next stream I'll say rather than tomorrow night, um, yeah, I'm not sure what I want to do yet, um, uh, we may play some OSMT, or we might do something new, 
Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Tempted to start um, Twilight Princess soon, because I think that'll be fun. But yeah, I'll see. All right. Thank you guys. Be well. And I'll uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.